Well, I want to welcome everyone to tonight's very, or today, or this morning's very special presentation. Depending on where you are right now in the world, we have people that are literally watching from all points of the globe. We have Rampu. Rampu is over in, I think you said Thailand, right? Is that right, Rampu? Uh, we have Daniel, Daniel Lewis from Boston. We've got uh, Benice. Denise is here in Arizona. Let us know where you're watching from. What part of the world are you watching from? So just use the chat box, the questions box that you see here. And, uh, you know, this presentation is brought, brought to you by our good friends over at Mind Movies. We've got Queen in Florida. Nick from Canada. Good to have you, Nick. Henry from Alabama. Henry, not too far from us. Uh, Julie from Hawaii. All right, so we've got Anna Marie from South Dakota. Nice. Anna Marie, are you guys getting snow out there? Uh, we've got Rose from Denver, Colorado. He-Man from Colorado also. Wow, okay. Uh, we've got Shin from Chicago. Uh, Queen from Florida. Or Vicky from Florida. Uh, Henry says no, no snow. Okay, cool. So we've got uh, Send Me from New York. If I mispronounce your name, please forgive me. My screen is a little bit... Uh, blurry right here. This called a webinar screen is very weird sometimes. We've got uh, Vaz from New NYC, is that? And then we've got Raheem from Canada. We've got South Dakota. Uh, wow, 22 degrees, says Kerry in South Dakota. That's insane. Australia. We've got Hammett from Australia. Good to have you. New Zealand. Anne Marie from New Zealand. Wow, okay, so we really have a global audience that's watching this. Well, as I mentioned just a few moments ago, this presentation is brought to you by our good friends uh, over at Mind Movies, Natalie uh, and the whole crew over there. And, you know, what you're going to learn tonight is a three-step process for publishing books to Amazon's Kindle and how to do that in a way that, number one, it's very straightforward, it's very easy to do, and number two, it allows you to create a recurring passive income stream. What's beautiful about what you're about to learn in just a few moments is that Amazon has put together a system that literally allows and welcomes people from all points of the globe to participate in. So I'm very excited to have this, this very universal group that's watching right now. And in just a moment, I'm going to bring on our guest for tonight, his name is Mr. Tom Jandula. He's actually from the UK. And Tom is going to share with you this three-point system that will show you how to just literally get up and running. And I think you'll be pleasantly surprised by the information and the amount of exact how-to information that Tom's going to give you. So with that said, before we bring on our guest, I want you to make sure that you grab a piece of paper or a notepad or a notebook or something to write with, take notes with, and then I want you to also grab a pen or a pencil or a marker or a crayon, a piece of chalk, whatever you have at your disposal to take notes with because you're going to want to take notes. Now, with that said, can everyone hear my voice? If you can't hear my voice, type yes into the questions box, and obviously if you cannot hear my voice, you won't be typing yes. This is going to be a highly interactive webinar. You know, the folks over at Mind Movies, they said, our crowd is a crowd that loves to participate. They love to ask questions, all right? So that's awesome. Tom says yes from Canada. Good, to have, good Tom. Thank you. Everyone else says yes. Sin, Harry, Rebecca, Chance, Queen, Sunny, all right, Julie, Catherine, Tom, Daniel, Lewis, Herman. So awesome, awesome. So, you know, what I want to do is I want to make sure that you ask as many questions as possible. I know sometimes when you're watching presentations like this, some of the information can go over your head if you're new, right? If you're new to the whole concept of what's being presented. So our theory is that there's no such thing as a dumb question. So if you ever have a question, please use this questions box, the same questions box that you just typed yes into, to ask your questions. I will be in the background answering questions. All right, at a rapid pace, so I want you to keep me busy. And then Tom will be also answering questions from here, you know, here and there during the presentation as he uh, goes over everything with you. And then at the end of this, we're going to have a very, very extensive uh, Q&A session. So, again, ask your questions. So with that said, Tom, are you there? Are you with us? Yes, I am. Can everyone, uh, can you hear me okay? Am I coming through loud and clear? 
you're coming through loud and clear. Let's see. Let's make sure that everyone can hear you. Henry says yes. Everyone says here, yes. Can everyone hear the uh, English accent coming through your speakers? Give us a yes if you hear the uh, English accent. Herman says yeah. yes. Yeah, I'll carry yes. Nick, yes. Oh, they're flying up. Excellent. Henry, Henry, Eddie, Rebecca, Sin, Chance. Yeah, so we've got a ton of people that are around here, and they're excited. They look like they're eager to learn. This is something that people love learning about, right? And the beautiful thing about this is you can do this even if you are not a writer. So even if you're not a writer, you can also do this if you do love writing and if you're passionate about writing. So you can do this if you are uh, a teenager, if you're a senior. As a matter of fact, my 15-year-old daughter does this, and she makes about four to five thousand dollars a month okay so are you ready to learn about this entire system Jane says she thought you were Aussie at first time well wow, okay so that's different all right they're ready all right well let's uh, yeah let's get rocking and rolling with this because guys we do have a lot of stuff to get through here and that's something really important actually that uh, I want to say before we get going make sure you've got a pen and paper um, pen and paper to write something down because a lot of the times you know you can we come on these um, interactive sort of training sessions and webinars and stuff and uh, you know we sort of end end up end up sort of half listening but we're going to literally Ty and I are going to give you the entire uh, process we're going to give away the farm or at least as much as we possibly can within the uh, 90 or so minutes that we have together obviously <laughs> we've got to be respectful here depending on what time of the uh, what time it is with you wherever you are in the globe but we're going to definitely give away the farm so please uh, make sure you've got pen and paper and like Ty said he's going to be in the uh, he's going to be in the background answering questions for you so if I go quite fast fast paced through any of the training then uh, please feel free to uh, ask a question and then if we do miss any don't panic we're definitely going to stay on and have a good Q&A at the end. So, with that being said, if everyone it looks like everyone can hear us, everyone is here. So let's uh, let's dive into this. All right, guys. So very quickly and uh, very briefly, uh, just want to tell you about who I am and why you are hearing my English voice coming through your speakers and what you know what makes me qualified to actually sit here and. Uh, Take, uh, give, give you this presentation and take your time up this evening, which, I, by the way, I'm very honored that you guys have shown up, and that's um, it's going to be worth your time. We're going to really share some amazing stuff that has been quite literally life-changing. I know that's quite um, that term gets thrown around quite a lot, and it's easily used, but I don't use that lightly. Um, I mean, it literally has been life-changing for me. In fact, uh, what I'm about to share with you uh, on, this, on this presentation, this webinar, has basically uh, took me from, I was a broke bartender. Um, I came over to the US um, on a golf scholarship. I left school when I was 16. So to back up what Ty was saying about not being a writer, uh, just because it's Kindle and it's to do with books and stuff, don't worry, we're going to show you the entire system of how you don't have to be a writer for this at all. And in fact, I wasn't. So I was 16. I left school at 16 to be a professional golfer. Um, I got pretty good, but it's not good enough. But I did end up coming over to America and playing over here, which is um, why, where I'm actually based now. I'm actually based here in uh, Hilton Head. South Carolina, and uh, coming to you, coming to you live, and uh, that's how I ended up here. But I ended up just bartending, and once that was, once the golf career wasn't going to take off, I didn't really um, know where to go or what to do after that. And uh, I tried. I found the online world. Now I'm sure many of you have sort of. Uh, heard about you know online businesses some of you may even have online businesses um, or be looking to start an online business because it is it's amazing it gives you freedom you get to work from home make your own hours travel and all that good stuff but what you don't realize is that uh, it can be quite frustrating if you've never if you've never been able to sort of uh, piece it together um, put the pieces of the puzzle together and the thing is is that what a lot of people don't tell you is there is quite a lot of pieces to put together to actually have a successful online business well, the great news is, is that, as you're about to see in a very short while, there's only three pieces of the puzzle you have to put together to have success with um, with Kindle and make you know have an online business with Kindle. And uh, that was really why I was able to succeed with it. And that's I had spent a lot of money on everything, on lots of other strategies and stuff. And I really wanted to make it work. Um, I really that was 
I had my heart set on it. Now, the one good thing was is that I was pretty determined, um, like all of you, uh, obviously, because this has been brought to um, us by my movies. So uh, you guys are all into the personal development stuff like I am, and I know Ty is as well. Um, and one of the things, obviously, I wasn't going to give up. I knew it was possible. Uh, I just had to find the right... Um, the right system to follow. Um, you know, the saying goes, there's, um, you, know, you know, people people fail and systems will succeed. You know, it's not systems that fail, it's the people. And that's where I was struggling. And I had no technical skills. That was really what my hang-up was, was that I, um, I, I, you know, I couldn't get my head around building websites and um, doing any of that stuff. It's just not in me. I'm just not a technical technical person, which is kind of challenging when you want an online business, right? It's kind of, kind of hard to make money on the internet if you, if you can't even uh, you know, put a basic... Uh, basic website up or anything like that, given most strategies and stuff out there. So it was pretty hard and it was pretty challenging for me. Now, um, I was very fortunate in the fact that uh, although you know, family told me that, you know, especially particularly, you know, particularly mums like, you've got to get a job, what are you doing? This online stuff doesn't work, love her to pieces, but doesn't, you know, from a different different time era, not interested in computers, doesn't understand the possibility. So um, I had a lot of people. Now, luckily for me, I had a very supportive wife. This is my wife, Jackie, my lovely wife, Jackie. And um, in the picture here with me, by the way, this is me, not just some random pictures, random person at a wedding. <laughs> this is actually me, so you can put a face to the voice. Um, and anyway, all this was building up, and I was about to actually give up when luckily I met... Ty Cohen, who you just heard from earlier, and everything changed for me. Now, I have to be honest here. The st system that I'm sharing with you, these steps that I'm going to share with you, I can't take credit for these. All the credit goes to the man answering the questions in the question box, Mr. Ty Cohen. Um, everything that we're bringing to you tonight is thanks to him. He's basically found this fantastic, uh, very simple system for publishing books on Kindle and making a ton of money with it. And uh, I was fortunate enough to uh, basic meet Ty, and he shared these strategies with me. And now uh, he and I have ended up becoming business partners. And uh, he asked me, and I come on and sort of share my story and my success that I had with this system um, just to sort of demonstrate that anyone can have success with this it's you know no matter what skill level you know like I said left school at 16 um, I have zero writing ability I'm dyslexic so I my wife fills out most of my forms and stuff I mean it's terrible so if I can do this anyone can so um, you know and you're gonna see really how easy it is but when Ty got uh, Ty started out with this. Um, Ty, when Ty first got into this, he wasn't making any money on Amazon at all, and he went from making zero money to now making over thirty thousand dollars a month. Thirty thousand dollars a month, and the best thing is, is that this is passive income, guys. This is uh, this isn't you know a lot of there's not a lot of work that goes into this as you'll see once the work's done it's done one time and uh, it truly is recurring revenue passive recurring revenue which is just wonderful and it's a true true business model now before we get into this I know I've teased you there with a bit of sort of earning potential and I apologize for that but I better just make sure that everyone is clear as to what a Kindle is now the reason I say this is because I was talking with someone the other day and trying to explain what it is that I do and how, you know, just working from home and that anyone can do it. Well, I guess if you don't know what a Kindle is, that would be a bit of a challenge, right, <laughs> to actually succeed with this. So uh, in case you've had your head in the sand for the last uh, two, two years, this is a Kindle device. And basically, it is a portable ebook reader that was developed by Amazon. Amazon.com, and it allows uh, its users to basically shop, browse, download, read ebooks, newspapers, magazines, blogs, reports, pretty much any digital media. And it's the innovation, it's the brainchild or innovation of this gentleman right here. Um, this is Jeff Bezos. Uh, for those of you that don't know, that's the um, CEO and founder of Amazon.com. So, this is the gentleman whose pockets we have been lining for the last 15 years. If you're like me, I spend a fortune on Amazon. I love the, I love it. It's just what an amazing company. Um, but it's really nice now. We've actually got a uh, chance to get some of that, plug into their success, and uh, and uh, share some of that success with them, which is really really cool. But basically, he saw the uh, change that was happening in the music industry. 
the he saw you know um, the how everything was went going digital online. I mean, uh, we've all seen it. I mean, we all witnessed it, right? We it wasn't you know a lot of Steve Jobs really uh, really revolutionized it with iTunes and creating the iPad and the iPod and you know what was it the thousand songs in your pocket I think was the slogan um, or ten thousand songs in your pocket which is the original iPod slogan um, but we all saw it I mean it was happening before that I mean in fact you guys just throw in here what's the um, now I'm uh, I'm 29 so uh, my sort of I go back to probably Vinyl, I would say. You know, I remember my dad having some. I remember my dad having vinyl records and growing up with vinyl records. But what do you guys? It's always interesting to see what everyone remembers. How far back have we got? If anyone's not too embarrassed to say, throw in the chat box. What does everyone remember here? The what was the uh, last um, the music Let's progression see. that we've seen here? We've got Ed, Eddie says eight tracks here. So he says uh, Rose says eight tracks. Yeah, we had eight tracks, and then we have we had vinyl. We had uh, so we went from like. Eight tracks, right, to cassettes, then vinyl, and uh, from vinyl we went to what CDs was it, right? Forty-five says Kiri, absolutely. Rebecca says eight tracks. Real, real tape says Tom. Tom's going way back. Wow. Okay, awesome. And uh, so yeah, so they they remember. I mean, when we used to listen to our music primarily in in a physical format. So for like uh, music that we really enjoyed, we would have to listen to it in the form of an eight track or cassette or 45 or real or real as Tom said or a CD okay uh, and Marie says I can remember my grandparents having a band recorder wow okay so and uh, they get it and, and they see that that transition where we've went from listening to our music in a physical format to now listening to it in primarily a digital format which is similar to what you're talking about here right Tom yeah absolutely I mean that was it I mean Steve Jobs really um, commercialized it in a big way with the you know we'll never we'll never go back um, mu music wise however a lot of people don't realize that the how big it's got the digital um, the digital sales of books has got um, and that's really what uh, Steve Jobs uh, Steve Jobs Jeff Bezos was going after because he saw the uh, the shift that was happening in the music business and had the foresight to see that the potential was there for physical books as well. Now for those of you that don't know, Amazon originally was originally designed or uh, created, founded to be the world's largest online bookstore. You know, it's developed now into the monster that it is, but originally it was just books, right? And um, just to give you an idea of how um, successful and how popular uh, digital books are, these Kindle digital books are. Um, for the, uh, Jeff Bezos has gone on record to say for every hundred physical books that Amazon has sold, the company has sold over 200 Kindle books. Now, if you think, Amazon's been selling physical books since its inception, which was you know 15 years ago or whatever it is, or maybe been longer now, um, but since its inception. So, in the short time that Kindle came to the market that Jeff Bezos brought the Kindle to the market and started putting books digital. They not only did they match the amount of sales that had taken uh, place over the previous 15 years, they doubled it, double the amount of sales. So um, I mean, we're talking just billions of downloads of these uh, of these digital books. So and uh, th thankfully he went and created this because it's opened up a huge opportunity for for us. But this isn't just like something that's um, slipped under the radar. I mean, there are people out there that have had in such incredible success with this. Um, not just not just Ty or myself, you know, or our stu or our students. They've, there are people that have had in really incredible success with this, and it, to the point where it's been published um, across the web, you know, by all the major news outlets. So you've got like CNN here uh, talking about how fast the uh, ownership of tablet e-readers almost doubles in one month. Um, CNN's covered it. Mashable Tech, which is like a tech blog, uh, they covered it, saying that Amazon sell, Amazon sells one million Kindle products each week. I mean, that is just insane. A million Kindle products each week, and it, like I said, it's only been around for a couple of years. It hasn't been around very long. Um, so this, the popularity and the success of this has been huge. Uh, Wall Street Journal even covered it, uh, turning Amazon Cash uh, to kindling. So you know, if it's if Wall Street Journal is covering it, it's got to be a pretty legitimate uh, uh, business venture, if you like. Otherwise, they just certainly wouldn't uh, 
I wouldn't cover it. Um, and Forbes as well, same thing. Uh, they did an article on this girl called Amanda Hocking. Um, they were saying, who wants to be a Kindle millionaire? Because uh, Amanda Hocking was able to self-publish books on Kindle, and she's 26 years old, and she uh, made a million bucks. In fact, uh, I'll tell you a bit about her here. Basically, Amanda Hocking, along with some other people as well, have just become insanely rich. Now, I, you know, I showed you that... Um, the, that we talked about that thirty thousand um, dollars a month uh, in revenue that Ty was doing, but you know Amanda Hocking, Stephen Leather, and John Locke, the, the people on this page here, they blow us out of the water. You know, they make what Ty and I are doing look like chump change. I mean, Amanda Hocking, like I said, she was twenty six years old, girl from Minnesota. Uh, she had she wasn't like a um, an English literature major, or she she wasn't a journalism major, or anything like that. She was just a regular girl from Minnesota, 26 year old girl from Minnesota who liked to write and she was able, because of Kindle, she was able to publish her own short stories and uh, she's made millions, I mean absolutely millions, I'm not going to go into all the details now, you can look her up online, there's so many um, stories about her online where she was, uh, and now she got picked up by uh, major things, now when I say short stories by the way, I want you to know they were about, I think they were about 17 to 20 pages long. So, you know, we're not talking Lord of the Rings epics here. We're just talking, you know, short stories. Uh, you've got Stephen Leather here. He's another one. Uh, he was a fellow Brit from the UK. And he sells about 2,000 ebooks a day on Kindle. 2,000 ebooks a day. So, if he was selling them for $2, that would be $4,000 a day in uh, in income there, which is... Uh, <laughs> that's a nice, that, that's a handsome uh, profit there. I mean, there's a lot that you can do with that, right? That's a mortgage, car payment, everything. I mean, just in one freaking day, right? Imagine that. How many people can imagine just pulling in two grand in uh, one day from, from digital books? So, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, that success is just insane. I mean, you and I do very well from this, but that is... <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. incredible, right? That is amazing. So, and then you've got like uh, John Locke. Now, John Locke was probably the most uh, notorious person because he was the first person to sell a million Kindle ebooks. And he was able to do it in less than a year, and he was able to do it with just nine titles. So, and that's according to Amazon. That was Amazon was able to came out and said that you know this was done with nine titles and it was done in less than a year. So the potential here, guys, is huge. Now, obviously, I'm not promise. I can't guarantee you following the three-step system that I'm going to give you that you'll sell a million Kindle eBooks in less than a year. Of course, I can't guarantee that. But you see the potential here. Um, is huge and of course in addition to people like this there's lots of people like Ty, myself, um, people making you know anything from a thousand dollars a month um, with a nice little side business all the way up to you know thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars a month um, and students following our system as well so uh, the potential is huge so this is the ground level guys this is really is a digital diamond line and it's barely in its infancy I mean, it really, truly is. We've barely scratched the surface with this. And uh, the possibilities when this grows are going to be huge. One, because Amazon's going and putting its Kindle devices into more and more countries. So you're going to get more and more people. Uh, but plus, I mean, you know, some, for example, you know, video is such a standard thing right now for us in many places. But you still can't put video into your eBooks yet. So as soon as that happens, I mean, there are going to be millionaires created overnight from people that have already got their Kindle books in there, and then they're able to put advertising. I mean, the potential is just huge. Um, but even without all that, the potential that's coming, just getting started. Let's have a look at a couple of. I want to show you a couple of uh, some of the checks that Ty got when he first started out, um, when and how this uh, three-step system came to uh, came to be. Um, and you'll see how very quickly you can um, start earning some really good money now. I do want to make this very clear, though, and I have to uh, say this quick disclaimer. You know, um, the checks that you're about to see were, of course, a result of received because of publishing content for Kindle on Kindle. Um, now, these are, of course, not typical. I can't guarantee that you will make the same amount of money. I mean, this is, of course, I'm sure everyone understands this, but... Um, the only thing I can guarantee is if you don't do anything, 
If you do nothing, then you will make nothing. That is what I can guarantee. But of course, you know, um, you do it. Ha you have to take action. Now, this system is easy. It is very easy. It's three steps to it. Um, but of course, it does require that you actually do the steps. So. I'm sure that you're all aware of that, but I just wanted to make it clear. Anyway, here is the first check that Ty got um, from Amazon when he started this with the first ebook. Now, uh, Ty, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it was th uh, three books um, you started off with. Is that right? Ty? Nope, we may have lost Ty there for a second. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm pretty sure, guys, it was three books that Ty started with. And uh, he was able to bring in $2,297. $2,297, which is pretty impressive amount of money. I've got to be honest, you know, when I first, you know, when I first got into this, and like I said, I was, a br I was just bartending uh, paycheck to paycheck, totally broke. I was in massive amounts of debt. And... I, you know, two thousand dollars over two thousand dollars, twenty two hundred bucks would have been a huge, huge, um, massive change in my life, like significant amount of money to me back then. Um, and this was just with, you know, Ty was able to do this with just three books in those first that he uploaded. But what's really interesting, although this is a really good amount of money, the what happened next is really, really interesting. So. This was the second check that Ty got for 2,873. Now, not a huge increase, but there was an increase. It went to a 25% increase on the uh, commission uh, on the royalties for those three books. Now, this was the same three books, but yet it jumped 25% in royalty. And Ty did nothing. You know, he just actually. I think by if um, if you ask him, he'll say that he was actually doing the same thing. You know, a lot of us do when we get uh, come online and try and have an online business. You try and do too many things, right? We you, we get distracted. We try and do too many things at once rather than focusing on the one thing that works. Well. Ty was no different, and once this first check came in, you know, he was doing too busy doing those other things, and although that $2,000 is nice, it wasn't, um, he was distracted with other things, so, but once this check came in for $2,873, with that 25% increase, it caught his attention, but I just want to see, what guys, what do you think caused that jump in income? So, that, uh, what do you think, put that in the chat box for me, what do you think caused that um, spike in the sales there? Even though there, there was the same amount of books, nothing was changed, what do you guys think that was? That's a great question. Let's see who gets it Gets it right. You know, Natalie, the Mind Movies folks over at, uh, folks over at Matt, the Mind Movies says that this is a very smart group. They're, they love to answer questions. So, let's see. Re Rebecca says, more people getting Kindles every day. You have it, Rebecca. That's one of them. There's several reasons why those checks increased month to month and why they continue to increase month to month. So Rebecca hit it right on the head. So she says more people getting Kindle devices every day, right? So that makes sense as well as people downloading the Kindle application. Good reviews, says Brian. Absolutely, Brian. Right. So as your book gets more and more good reviews, that's social proof. So people understand that it's a good product. It's a good ebook. So they in turn want to go in and read it and try it out as well. Uh, Queen says both. She says reviews and more Kindles. Absolutely, Queen. You have it right. Uh, Chance says recommended reading or placement on top seller list. Bingo. Chance, you got it right as well. Pat yourself on the back because the beautiful thing about this is that Amazon handles all of the marketing. How many times have you ever purchased something from Amazon and they've suggested similar items to you as well? So how many times have you seen that where they'll say people who purchase this also purchased Okay, so there you go, Tom. Yeah, and uh, just saying on that. In fact, that's how they get me all the time. I would say that I would say that of, of all the. Oh, and by the way, guys, I just want to throw in here. I should say this: you do not need a Kindle. Ty, these checks that came in, and still to this day, you know, you don't have a Kindle device, right? No, I don't. I don't. So that's a great, great. Um, you don't you don't need one at all. You don't need a Kindle because you're and not I don't, publishing your books to a Kindle device. Yeah, I don't, guys. I don't have a Kindle device. I read all my Kindle stuff. I do read Kindle books. Exactly. Who's that? Uh, Sin said. Sin said. Yeah, I've got a Kindle app on my phone. Exactly. I've just got an iPhone and an iPad, and that's exactly what I. Uh, that's where I. That's where I read all my stuff from, and that's how they get me because they recommend. 
you know, I'll read something like Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill, or, you know, we'll read, it could be anything by Deepak Chopra or any of those, you know, really great people, uh, but they'll recommend stuff. So then they'll recommend something from like Brian Tracy, you know, you know, eat that frog or something like that. And I'm like, oh yeah, I want that, you know, I'll buy that, I'll buy that, I'll buy that. And that's how they get me. So I never end up actually, really, I never really go looking for books. Um, I do, they get recommended to me from Amazon and you're going to see, and that's why guys, these, um, this is such a fantastic thing because uh, you, once you've done those, done the work, Amazon's actually going to go to work for you and start help creating those and uh, marketing those books for you, which is just a, which is incredible. Anyway, as you're going to see, so let's get going because we've got tons of stuff to get through. So this is where it starts to get pretty exciting. Once. I saw this increase, so this 25% increase. Anytime you can find a business that you don't actually have to do any extra work for, you know, that work was done, the initial work was done, which was uploading the three books, right? Putting the books onto Amazon, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do that, by the way, uh, coming up here. Uh, but we put those um, onto Amazon, we got them into Amazon. And then those checks came in. And then that was it. I mean, that was job done. The first check comes in, and then nothing's touched, and you get another check, but that check increases. That you want to pay attention to, because anytime um, you know, your profits increase with no extra work, there's something to this. And uh, Ty jumped on it. And so after that, he added, a, uh, started adding some more books to his account and tested some of the things. So Amazon lets you change things. Like you can change the picture on the cover of your book. So Ty tested a couple of these things, changed the headline on there to see if that would increase sales, and boom, the following month it went up to $4,462. So just by tweaking a couple of things on those three books, so just you know, changing the cover, the front cover, having a nice cover created, and again, I'm going to show you how you can do that on this, uh, in this, on this uh, training session. So just by testing and tweaking a couple of really simple things, adding a couple of different words to the headline, we're able to double the amount of sales, still from the same amount of books, which is amazing. So jump to 4,000. So we're three months in and up to $4,462. Um, and then the following month, it just it just blew up, up to $8,403. And, uh, you know, Ty started adding uh, more titles once he got the system down, realized how to, he could rinse and repeat this process and was able to then just grow this business into, um, you know, the powerhouse that it is today, over $30,000 a month um, and pretty much completely passively. Now, Zyrex is taking him 10 years to find something that's this easy to make money with. I haven't been trying to make money on the internet for 10 years. I haven't, but I've been at, I was at it for a couple of years with no success at all. I failed at everything previously, uh, you know, leading into this. So I have to agree that for me, I was 100% stand behind that statement. This is uh, the easiest, and you're about to uh, you're about to see uh, exactly how this is. So who on here would like to? Who I hope this has uh, piqued everyone's attention here, and uh, this is uh, some interesting stuff. So uh, who here would like to see what we're actually going to show you guys this evening on this presentation? Is this uh, is this piqued your interest? Give me a big yes in the chat box. I don't want to make sure we're not. Uh... Jill says me. I do. I do. Says Rose. Yes. Says Brian. Rebecca. Says I do. Yes, says an enemy. Anne Marie. Nick says, oh yeah. Sin says, yes. Henry, yes. Kermit, Senny, Eddie, Fr Frida, Daniel, Queen, Herman, Jim, Tom, Jane. Yes, yes, yes. Says Jane Howard. Carrie, can't wait. Yeah, buddy, says Chance. So, uh, yeah, they're excited. Awesome. We've got a great. Great group here, and guys, thank you so much. And guys, it's it's this is awesome. Thank you for answering in the chat box. Uh, it makes this so much more fun for time myself when you guys are active. So yeah, like I said, keep the questions coming in because this is where we're going to get into the real heart and show you. Literally, I'm going to reveal the three steps. Simple. It's a simple three-step system um, that we go through to uh, get this, make this kind of money uh, through Kindle, and anybody can do this. So, with that being said. Ha let's have a talk about what we're going to actually cover now in the training. So in the next couple of minutes, I am literally going to show you the three-step system that we use. And we just rinse and repeat the same system. That's it. I'm going to show you how, <clears throat> show you which markets sell the best. So how you can find markets before you do anything. So you know, um, you might have an idea for a book, but you don't want to go in and potentially um, 
spend any time um, doing putting the book together if it's not going to sell. We want to make sure that there are people out there willing to spend money. So we can. We're going to. I'm going to show you exactly how to find stuff that's going to sell uh, before you actually lift a finger and do any of the work. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to pick winning titles for your. Um, I said with those checks, Ty made some tweaks to the title. Well, we've now got this down to a science, and there are some really cool ninja stuff we can do to the titles of our books, which will outsell everything else in the same category on the Amazon store. Also, we're going to show you how to uh, publish your books. We'll show you the websites you need to use um, and how basically simple it is and some really key uh, points when you actually do publish your books yourself. Uh, plus, I'm going to show you the number one price point um, that it right now is proving to really convert really, really well and make a lot of money right now. So you're basically going to get the keys to the kingdom. I mean, you will literally be able to take this information I'm about to share with you and by the end of tonight, my promise is to you that you will have enough information to go and have a really good stab at this um, in the next, you could probably have a book up, I would say, in the next 72 hours, you could have a book on Amazon um, if you take action on what we're going to show you and you can start making some money and getting those checks coming in. So, everyone seems excited, everyone's pumped, let's, uh, let's dive right into this. So, first of all, step number one of the three-step system is research. So we want to make sure that we find topics that make money. We want to make sure that we find topics that make money. Now, you can literally sell content on almost any topic, um, except obviously illegal stuff like no porn, stuff like that. Um, although, that being said, um, Fifty Shades of Grey uh, which I'm sure we're all, you know, if 99% of people on here, I'm sure are familiar, you guys are familiar with. Uh, Fifty Shades of Grey is like is the sort of erotica, um, romantic erotica. I'm not quite sure exactly the niche that falls under, but Fifty Shades of Grey started as a Kindle ebook. Fifty Shades of Grey started a Kindle book, and now that has gone on to become a billion-dollar franchise already, and the movies haven't even come out yet. So, I mean, guys, the potential's huge. So, again, <laughs> whatever you want to publish, you can publish, and the, you can really, you know, if, and remember, if you do have a Fifty Shades of Grey hit, please remember that you heard it here first. I will take kickbacks, just saying. I will absolutely, nice little brown paper bag with some money in would be great. I'll happily, I'll happily take that from you. Thank you very much. <laughs> anyway, so we can do how-to information. We can publish stories. We can do guides, reports, manuscripts, biographies. You can even do like you can even do courses, part one, part two, part three in a course. Um, now, for the purposes of this uh, time that we have together, I'm going to focus more on showing you how to do like the how-to stuff because how-to information is very simple. Anyone can do this. Um, you can anyone can do all of them, but how-to is very easy to understand and get into it. But again. This applies to fictional stories. In fact, my wife and I, we're starting some children's books. We're going to go uh, start publishing uh, children's books uh, and children's, needs, children's story books as well. So with, a person, with actually with a personal development undertone to them all, with personal development message in each one. So pretty cool stuff. So you can do anything. But let's take a look at a couple of easy ways that we can find these hot topics to publish. And we need to use a tool from Google. Um, and it's called the Keyword Tool, or it's actually called the um, Google Keyword Planner. Okay, so write that down, please. The Keyword Planner. What you're going to do is go over to Google and just Google it. Okay, like you can see here on the screen. Type that into Google, uh, and it'll be the top one here. It says Google AdWords Keyword Planner. Now, you will have to you will have to sign up for a Google AdWords account, but don't worry, it's totally free. Everything that I'm showing you here is free, and this is. Uh, part of a bigger service that Google offers, um, which is to do with their advertising network. But don't worry about that either. We're not spending money on ads. We just want to use the keyword tool that is in AdWords. Okay, so we're literally this is a means to an end. But it doesn't don't be uh, scared by the fact that it says ads and you know budgets and that kind of stuff because we're not going to be spending any money on ads. We're literally using it for research. So when you come into the AdWords account, this is what it looks like. So you can come over here, you click Tools Analysis. Uh, you can come down here and click search for new keyword and I add group ideas. Okay, so this is the one we want. Search for new keyword and add group ideas. All right, and we click that. 
and you'll be look at you'll look at a page with a box like this, and what it's going to say is enter one or more of the following, either a product or a service. Okay, so in this box here, where my cursor is, in this box here, you are going to type in anything that you are either passionate about. So it can be a hobby. Um, maybe something that you have knowledge in, that you're skilled in. Maybe you are in a corporate world, and there's something particularly good that you are um, that you do in your job at the corporate world. Maybe it's one specific skill that you have. Um, it could be productivity, organization. Um, it also could be if you are, uh, like I said, into hobbies. It could be knitting. Uh, it could be gardening. Right? Any of these hobbies, golf, tennis, anything like that. It really doesn't matter. Horse riding. It really doesn't matter what you type in there. Um, it's really just to go through the process. So pick something that you're interested in, you know, something that you have, because otherwise you'll spend, I don't want you to get caught up on not knowing what to type in there. Just go with it. This is a, supposed to be a fun process. So really have fun with it. I mean, if it's something like how to restring a tennis racket, maybe you're a tennis pro and that's, you're really, really good at regripping tennis rackets. If that's it, then type it in. You're going to see why we're doing this, and it's a bit of fun. So have fun with this. Whatever you want it to be, type that in there. And what we're going to see is basically what it's going to do is Google's going to give us the search results for whatever we type in, uh, meaning they, Google tracks every search that is done in Google. So all the billions of people typing into Google, when they search, that gets tracked. And we can actually see how many people are searching for different topics um, on a monthly basis. So uh, for this example, I typed in dreams and interpretation. So you can see here at the top, dreams interpretation, okay? That's what was typed in. So what do dreams mean? The meaning of dreams, right? So again, I'm interested in that topic. That's a fascinating topic for me, like the study of lucid dreaming, what do dreams mean? I'm fascinated with that. So again, you choose something that you're interested in and uh, when you run through this. So type that in at the top, so dream interpretation. Then what happens is when you say get ideas, they give you what they call an ad group. But again, don't get scared off by the term ads. What we want to look at is this keyword by relevance here, so keywords. and what. Uh, Google will do is based on whatever you've typed in here, so dreams interpretation, Google will then find terms that are searched for on that topic. So for example, meaning of dreams. We typed in dreams interpretation and Google knows that there are, so Google tells us there are people typing in meaning of dreams into Google. And it'll also tell us how many people are searching for that. So how many people are actually typing this in? on a monthly basis. So we can see here, average monthly searches, 18,000. So that means 18,000 people every month are typing in meaning of dreams into Google, right? And then we can see here, a slight variation, dream meaning, we've got another 2,000 people, almost 3,000. Then we come down here, we've got dreams meaning, we've got 2,400, we've got uh, dream meanings with an S on the end, uh, we got another uh, almost 2,000 as well. So we can see there very quickly that if we add all these up, I mean, these people are all searching for the same thing, right? They're just a different way of typing it, adding an S on the end, different letters and stuff. So some plural, some aren't. We can see if we add these up, there's over 22,000 people every single month, every single month, there are 22,000 people searching in Google, actively searching in Google, for the meaning of dreams or something to that, you know, something to that, uh, a variation of that. And they are typing that in every day. So you can see here, very quickly, we can find topics that people are searching for. I mean, just take a second to imagine for a second, do this one, imagine for a second that you created a book on the meaning of dreams and what they mean. And you were able to, and you were then able to get that book created, whether you wrote it yourself or had someone else. And we're going to cover that, of course, coming up here in a minute. But just imagine that you created that book. You know, how many sales do you th do you think you'd be able to get a few sales of those twi over those twenty two thousand people every month that are searching for your book? I mean, give me a yes in the chat box. Do you think you'd be able to get some sales out of that? 
Uh, let's see. Nancy says yes. Eddie, yes. Tom, Rebecca. Jim says, of course, yeah. Rose says yes. Queen, Herman, Nick, Brian, Jill, Chin, Senny, Frida, Joe. Kareem, I think. I hope I'm not screwing that up. Kar Kareem? Daniel. Kiri. So, absolutely, says Kiri. Deb says, hell yes. <laughs> Bazinov says, yes. Kieran says, uh, yes. Absolutely. So, yeah, they, they, they're following along. They're getting it, and they understand that uh, this is how you go in and you do your research. So, good job so far. Marvelous, cool. And I'd like to do that just to make sure that everyone understands that before we move through, because it's all logical progression here that we're going to go through, guys. So, again, if you don't understand something, please throw it in the chat box. But, yeah, we can see that, you know, it's not very quickly. Within five minutes, we were able to find a really hot topic. I mean, that's a, you know, that's a hot topic of, you know, people that people are searching for. That would be a great book to write, you know, do our, do our subject on, su subject matter. Now, it gets better. It gets better. So, not only can we find the hot topics and markets for our books in Google using the Keyword Planner, but we can also basically find our title as well. Because one of the things, again, people get paralyzed over is names of things. You know, whether it maybe it's a domain name or or a name of a book or a name of a title. Um, now, luckily, we don't need domain names or anything like that because we don't have to build any websites or do any of those shenanigans uh, with this at all. But again, the title of the book can be quite challenging. People would spend a lot of time trying to, God, is it the right title? But again, this takes all that indecision out of our, our, uh, out of our hands. We have no indecision here because we can see, look at this, there are 18,000 people typing in meaning of dreams. Now, if you were to put a V at the front of it, so The Meaning of Dreams, that would be a pretty good title for a book. Not perfect, but pretty good. And I'm going to show you how to make it perfect in a minute. But it would be a pretty good title. I mean, you could see that in a bookstore. So now, not only are there people searching for our book, you know, the topic, the general topic, all these, all these searches here are about the actual general topic of the book. But we can actually see here... That there are 18,000 people typing in, literally typing in the title of our book as well. So not only the topic, but the literal title of the book. We have 18,000 people typing that in to our book. Do you see how easy this is? We're almost, it almost feels to me like I'm cheating, like I'm manipulating the system somehow, but it's, uh, it's not. It's like cherry picking, right? It, it just gets so easy where you're just going in and you, you're literally picking the cream of the crap. So I mean... And this is a free tool. You can use this to go in and literally go in and find hot markets. You can find markets that are in high demand. You can find out what people are researching for. And you can get great great titles here because a lot of this in a success of your ebook has to do with how well your title is crafted as well. So this is the perfect tool. Yeah, it's perfect. Cherry picking is exactly the right thing. Now, guys, there is a little tip. I have a tip. So, again, get your pens ready. Write this down. If you haven't been writing down, write this one down because I don't have this on a slide anywhere. So write this down. We have found that there is a magic number or at least a uh, margin, um, number margin that you want to be within when you pick your title. So if we see here, this is 18,000. That would be good. But if you look at, um, say, for example, if you did a search and you only got, say, 320 on your title down here, that would be too little. Now, what you want to do, and this is just a guideline, but it's a very good guideline to go by, so please, please remember this. When you're doing a search for your topic, so if you typed in dreams interpretation, if all you get is searches that have like 500, 500, 400, 300, if it doesn't collectively add up, to more than 10,000, so the minimum 10,000 average monthly searches, then it's too small of a niche, okay? There's not enough people searching for that topic, so you want to expand, okay? So that's how we know, because it's too sm if it's under 10,000 collectively, too small. Now, here's the interesting part, though. There is a, there is a cap, there's a ceiling to it as well, we found. And that is 100,000 global monthly searches. So, for example, if this here, meaning of dreams, if this was 200,000, 
and another one of these was say 12,000, I would actually pick the one that's 12,000 versus the one that is 200,000. Simply because we found that we get more, you'll get more sales and it's to do with the fact that it's, um, it's a lot more targeted to what the actual um, prospect or the potential customer person who's looking for your book is actually after. You're meeting their needs and this will make sense in a minute, but just write that down. So maximum of 100,000, minimum of 10,000 global monthly searches. And I'm going to test you on that in a minute, so write that down. All right, now, one question that some of you might be asking, and it's a perfectly legitimate question because it gets asked, it's been asked before, hence why we have a slide on it, <laughs> is if we're using Amazon, why are we not looking in Amazon for our research? Why are we searching in Google? Now, you can, you can use Amazon to search, and it's good. You look at the bestsellers list, and you can get topics, but here's the thing. That is, that's just one part of it. We use the Google keyword tool because Amazon, uh, Google loves Amazon. Google loves Amazon. And what that means is, is the higher you can get your titles ranked in Google, ranking means um, when you type something in, the first result. So if you can be up at that first result when someone types that in, the higher you can rank, the more money you're going to make, hands down hands down. This is how you really um, make a lot of money off one book is by finding one with a lot of searches and getting it and because Google loves Amazon it can rank very easily and get up there and found in Google. So I want to show you um, how this works and this is how people will just happen to find your book. They don't have to be in Amazon to find your book. They will be able to find it just by coming across it by accident on Google and you're about to see how powerful this is. So here's a book that is currently in Amazon. How to market and sell your ebook. Now if you type that in to Google, as you can see here, how to market and sell your ebook, you get the you'll get similar results to this. Now these first two results everyone now knows those are paid. So those two top results here, people are paying to be there. Um, and they're probably paying a lot of money to be there actually. <clears throat> so like I said, we don't have to because we're, we're using Amazon, right? We're leveraging Amazon so we don't have to pay for advertising. But what we can see here is there is our book. Number two. So we got this book Ed, and we are number two in those search rankings. But look at this. There are five million results that Google found for how to market and sell your ebook. We are number two out of five million. Let me repeat that. We are number two out of five million. Imagine if that is your book. So again, you've got, you've got let's say that dreams example, right? Meaning of dreams. There's 18,000 people every month typing the title of your book in and boom. Yours appears like this on that on the on the results of Google, and we already know we already know before we've done the work that those that there are eighteen thousand people every month actively searching for it, and that's huge. Just being able to get your book listed in in, in such a high um, high ranking order on a site like Google is just incredibly huge. As a matter of fact, Tom. Let's look at this this listing, right? And I want to ask him a question. I want to find out. It, it seems like everyone's paying attention, but I want to find out how closely they're paying attention. So answer this question, if you can, in the questions box, all right? And Tom says, uh, congrats, that's awesome. Kit Kat says, wow, that's a lot. Uh, Tom says, wow. So answer this question. Look at the listings. Right. What do you think the first two listings at the top in yellow, highlighted in, in uh, yellow, are? Who can, who gets the answer? What do you think the first two listings? Rose says those are paid ads. Queen says they're sponsored links. Absolutely. So most people, just like you know that they're sponsored links, they're paid ads, most people gloss over those. Most people then come down and they look at the generic listings. Now you have two generic listings there. Which one? Does your eye gravitate towards the most, and why? Let's see who gets it. The Amazon listing says Rose. Absolutely, the one that has the, the bright five stars says Daniel. Amazon says it has a review says Queen. Amazon because of the stars says Anne Marie. Uh, four stars says Eddie. Amazon and the rating says Rebecca. Amazon is more popular says Leia. 
Uh, Amazon is worldwide, says Herman. That's good. Amazon because it's credible. It's well known, says Brian. Uh, Deb says something similar because it's familiar. More details, says Tom. Right. Tom, you got it right. So that second one also, just like everyone who I just, uh, who, everyone else who just got it right as well. Amazon is a trusted source, says Chance. Um, you're absolutely right. Everyone who just answered is right. Right. That second listing, and this is the way that we show you how to do this. That second listing is more powerful because it has the reviews. There's 47 of them. It has the five star rating that makes it stand out. There's a price there. So instantly you know that if you're doing a Google search, you know that there's there's more information available on Amazon and it's available and it's for sale and the price is four ninety nine. You can see where to the right of that it says it's in stock. All right. Amazon is also a trusted site, as someone uh just said. I think it was uh Rose who said it's more familiar. Chance said it's a trusted source. Okay. If you also notice the search term that was entered into the Google search box is also in that listing. So the search term was how to market and sell your ebook. So it, the listing says Amazon.com, how to market and sell your ebook. And then you also have that blurb. You've got that bit of a summary down at the bottom. The excitement of the first few chapters builds an incredible momentum, and it it sort of draws that person in. So this is one reason. Why, when we publish our ebooks to Kindle and we do it the way that we show you in this program, why we're able to sell so well? All right. So, are you ready to see more examples like this? And are you ready to see, you know, some of the next steps that you can use to get your books really out there and really flying off the shelves, the digital shelves of Amazon? I'm ready, yeah. says Daniel. Tom, they're saying, flying yeah. in, certainly. Rose says yes. I'm so excited. That's <laughs> awesome. Oh yeah, big time, See, Nick. And and like what we like to do is we like to over deliver. We want to teach. We want to teach in a way that you understand. Okay, so we're glad to have everyone answering and 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 interacting as well. So this is cool. This is just a great great presentation. I'm I'm glad that we agreed to do this. So go ahead, Tom. You're ready. Awesome. Let's get kicking and cracking. So. Actually, and just to show you guys, this is not a fluke, you know, this happens a lot. Uh, here's another book. So, How to Earn uh, Passive Income in a Lousy Economy. Um, again, we can see here the price point is $7.99. $7.99. Um, you've got 29 customer reviews. And when you type that into Google, How to Earn Passive Income in a Lousy Economy, boom, look at that. Top, we got actually got three listings on here for the same book. Now, that's just even better with, than before. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, we're in there three times. And again, this is no small feat, guys. I mean, look at the results here. This is out of um, 1.5 million results. Now, I want to be clear. I've got to make this clear. That's not people searching. We, you know, we found the people searching by using the Google keyword tool. But this uh, results here is about how many pages of content Google has found on the internet on this subject that we typed in and out of all of that we are at the top so that shows you how powerful this is by using that Google keyword tool first then using Amazon to publish our books when we do that it's just it's it's literally for lack of a better term like taking candy from a baby not that you should do take candy from a baby but <laughs> Unless it doesn't like it, maybe a, can a candy from a baby that doesn't actually like candy. That's how easy it is. How about that? <laughs> Unless it's a payday, you know. If I if I see a six month old with a payday, I'm snatching the payday. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm joking, yeah. of course. There you go. That's, yeah, and guys, again, just think about this. This guy's this is selling for seven ninety nine. Seven ninety nine. You know, again, think of that. Think of that. Um, example we have with the dreams if there's 18,000 people every month and you know that before you go into this and you're showing up in Google uh, like this with Amazon's name next to your book not sort of not my name so it's not like Tom Yandula.com right or Tom Yandula.com where everyone's like who the hell is that guy you know you guys did, would have thought the same thing up until 20 minutes ago hell you might still think the same thing you may have forgotten what my name was who knows but uh, <laughs> but the um, the point being is it's Amazon's name, right? We know Amazon. In fact, Amazon has got 300 million credit cards on file. 300 million credit cards on file. That is how trusted this company is. That to the point where just by seeing the name, um, 
it'll trigger certain endorphins in the body because um, you know when people buy things it's like, it's like a shopping addiction right because it's addictive shopping is addictive well Amazon has got that down to a science so as soon as people actually click on this link here to your book I mean they are pretty much already sold <laughs> on the fact that they're going to buy your book because um, they go there with what's called buyer intent so they go there with they're already primed and ready to buy especially if they've already you've got your credit card on file there so it's just I mean the potential is anyway. and again seven ninety nine if there's eighteen thousand people looking for your book I mean it doesn't take much to to make you know doesn't take many books to make a you know to make a very very nice uh, passive live income um, off of this and of course then we just scale it up so Using the keyword planner, of course, we can find those good topics and we cherry pick the titles. Okay, I think you guys all get that now. Um, responses have been in there again. If you're missing anything, type in the chat box. Keep time busy. Um, you know, keep his fingers going. So, next up, we have what we call title enhancers. Now, this is after months of testing. All right, months and months of testing, we've found that simply adding some of the following elements that I'm about to share with you to your titles can dramatically uh, increase sales. I mean, to the point where, do you remember, if you think back to those checks, those first checks that I showed you, and I showed you those for a reason, um, because I want it helps me illustrate this point right here. So um, I can't remember off the top of my head um, what that second check was, but I think it was about 2,800 um, around that mark. And then it, it jumped. Time was able to get that to jump. Literally doubled it to over four thousand bucks. Right? Um, there was a fifty percent increase. Well, one of the things, like I said, that we can do is change the titles. Even after you have published the book to Amazon, you can change something. So you don't, by the way, have to get it perfect first time. So again, don't worry about getting things perfect the right time. You can always change it if you felt like you got the wrong title and change it later. In fact, you should test titles and this is what I'm talking about right here after after testing and months of testing we have found that little things can increase sales dramatically literally double and triple the sales just like you saw um, in those checks at the beginning so of course um, we've got them we're gonna give you some of those right now so that you can add them to your titles when you're searching so these are the title enhancers down the left hand side here now I give you some examples. I'm going to give you. I'm going to talk you through a few of these. We'll give you a chance to write these down or take a screenshot or whatever you want to do. Um, and you definitely want to write these down because this is going to have a lot to do with the amount of books that you have, you sell, and how successful your books are. If you get this, the philosophy behind this, and what? I'm sorry, I can't talk. And why we do this? then you are 100% ahead of the curve. So you definitely want to write these title enhancers down or take a screenshot, as Tom said, because you know there's a ton of them that we use, but we're going to give you uh, the, the couple that we have here, and we literally have dozens of these things that we use, and they just really help our eBooks fly off the shelves and allow us to make a lot of money. So as you've seen, this entire system is pretty straightforward. It's just really easy. So uh, I think they're ready, Tom. Awesome. And yeah, these and we've got a whole list of these, but these are the best ones. You know, we wanted to make sure we over delivered and gave you the you know, ones that really really do well. Obviously we can't give you them all, we don't have time to write them all down. But you got the uh, some of the best ones here that have really literally doubled and tripled sales and like Ty said, this system's so basic in its um in its you know simplicity really you know to do those research you've got the tools it's about just doing it in the right order so it's about piecing it together in the right order which is what we're obviously sharing here so um, something as simple as adding how to to your title can double and triple sales so um, you do your research and then think about adding a how to title enhancer to your title so for example how to stain your deck like a professional versus learn to stain your deck both of those, you know, you probably wouldn't look twice at. You wouldn't think consciously there's much of a difference between that. How to stain your deck like a professional and learn to stain your deck. But the difference in the amount of money you will make <laughs> from if you tight use those titles on your books is dramatic. Um, and the reason why of you know the reason why the, and of course the how to of course is going to outsell the learn to stay in your deck and the reason why is because when we add these title enhancers and this applies to all of them when we add these title enhancers to the title we are basically answering 
the questions that uh, people are subconsciously asking themselves in their head. Now, uh, there may be a better way of me saying that and phrasing that, but basically what it means is, you know, if I'm looking to stain my deck and I don't know how to do it, subconsciously I'm thinking to myself, how am I going to stain this deck? I don't know how to do it. So by adding how to to the title, you are talking directly to my subconscious. Right, so how to stay your deck like a professional, and it's something as simple as that. Um, and guys, I mean, this seems um, simple, but please don't let the simplicity of this uh, take away from how powerful it is. Um, it literally, this has been used in in ad writing and everything else for years, and this really works for Kindle as well. We've tested it; it does really well. So, how to stay your deck like a professional versus learn to stay your deck. Another one. Quickest ways to, so 21 quickest ways to make money online versus the guide to making money on the web. Again, such a small difference, but do you guys see how, the, just, do you guys see this, the subtlety in there and how that works? Does everyone, uh, everyone get that? Give me a yes in the chat box if this is all making sense. Eddie says, Jedi mind tricks, and Queen says, I get it. Absolutely. She's ready to move on. She says, I get it. Herman says, yes. Ha ha, says nice, says, uh, says chance. Yes, Jill. So uh, they all get it. They understand the psychology behind this. And uh, as Nick says, it's simple and it's easy. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Simple and easy, but don't overlook. It's so easy to overlook. Easy. Sim it's easy to do, but if it's easy to do, it's also easy not to do, as the late, great Jim, Jim Rohn would say. Do I, do I hear a little Jim Rohn here? Absolutely. Yeah, buddy. Love easy Jim Rohn. Easy to do as well as easy not to do. Yeah. It's easy to do, easy not to do. Anyway, so, go So, you pick the right easy. There you go. Pick one yeah. of those easies, the right one. So, we got easy ways to, tips to, uh, the world's best kept secrets to losing weight. Now, also, you don't have to use it at the front. You don't always have to use it at the beginning. You know, think, get creative with this. Think outside the box. So, cheapest way to do it. So, the ultimate guide to moving across country and the cheapest way to do it. Or there should be a to do it. And the cheapest way to do it at the end. But, so cheapest way to is a great one, and you can add it at the end. Now, most people wouldn't do that. You know, most people wouldn't add that. They would just do the ultimate guide to moving across country. Well, now you guys have the ninja tricks. You're going to add that, so the cheapest way to do it. All right, and you can test these different ones and what, what works best for you, so write these down. Um, you know, 21 tips. Tips is always good because tips is short. It's brief, and we live in a society of immediate gratification. I mean, we don't even have to go to the bookstore anymore, right? We can just download a book instantly onto our iPads and it's there. So, you know, we we don't want to learn anything anymore. We want the quick, di most direct, efficient route possible. So tips are quick and easy. So that's why that does really well. So 21 tips to being a better husband or wife, perfect example there. All right. I think everyone's getting this, so it's good. So we're going to uh, keep moving here. Um, if you need us at the end, we can always come back so you can write those down at the end. But... All right, so finally, let's do a final check here to see that everyone was paying attention for the research. And guys, I know we've hammered this point home here about research, but you get this right and the rest takes care of itself. All right, you get this right and the rest takes care of itself. So uh, we're back in the keyword tool here and typed in how to garden. All right, how to garden. So obviously how to garden, if you type that in, you're going to get about 45 million searches every month are done for how to garden. So it's uh, a little bit too, um, a little bit too, too broad, broad of a category there. So some of the other ad groups that uh, Google came up with that people are searching for were um, these ones here, all about raised garden beds. So based on what you have learned um, in the last 20 minutes about research, what title would we choose for our book? This is interesting. I want to see who gets it right. So we've given you a lot of information so far. Let's see. Herman says the last one. Uh, Julie says 12,400. Rebecca says the last one. Uh, Joe says the best way to garden. Wow, these answers are really flying in. We've got dozens and dozens of people answering. Angela says how to build a raised garden bed. Joe, last one. Frida... Uh, last one, how to build a raised garden bed, says Eddie, 12,400. Carrie, how to build a raised garden bed. Send the last one, Emmanuel, 12,400. Jim, Kit Kat, last one. <laughs> uh, Kit Kat, brilliant. I <laughs> love that. Kit Kat. <laughs> 
And uh, Angela, Angela, Angela says something that's pretty clever, right? Because the how to, all right, and plus, right? It's within our desired search criteria of, of 10,000 to 100,000. Angela, awesome. You really got it. You're a smart cookie there. So um, it has the, the how to, which is that title enhancer inside of it, and it also fits within our search criteria. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Got it. And let's say everyone got it right. And just to recap, remember I said, guys, man, I love doing this. <laughs> it's brilliant, isn't it? I love it. So look, just to recap, remember I said the minimum, 10,000. So that's why these would be too small. If, it, if this, these were our options, these would be too small. We'd want this one because it's over 10,000. But if there was one that was, say, 200,000, we would still go with this one because it's under 100,000. All right? So if you can get one up in sort of the... Um, 80,000 range uh, with a, you know, and get a title enhancer in there, you are going to be making bank from that book, I'll tell you now. <laughs> so that's what we want to look for. But you're, anything over 10,000, really, really good stuff. All right. Everyone... Yeah, and, and the other thing is really quickly, Tom, you know, you've got, uh, for everyone that said the last one, right, how to build a raised garden bed, there's 12,400 people looking for that. Do you think if you had 12,400 people searching for how to build a raised garden bed and your book was listed in Amazon, do you think it would be hard or easy to sell those people on your ebook? Exactly. With it, with it being that specific, it would be easy for you to, yes, Rose got it right. Everyone who's saying easy right now, you have it right. Absolutely. All right? Yeah, exactly. Especially the way it shows up in Google as well, you know, with those examples we showed you. Um, yeah, so, and everyone, just give me a big yes. So this is the research, right? This is the most important part. This is the, arguably, the, the, the hardest part, I would say, <laughs> if you could call this hard. Uh, it's really not. So just give me a answer chat box. Does everyone think they can do this so far? Just give me an I can do this in the chat box. Everyone put I can do this if you think you can do this. And Rebecca hit it right on the head. She says it's, it's uh, what does she say here? Just, it's, it's easy, yes, but it's a key part. That's right. It's crucial, right? Everyone can do this. We can do this, says Chance. I like that, Chance. Uh, no problem. I can do this. I can do this. And thank you for the great information, says Angela. Yes, I can. I can do this. And I would like to do it, Anne-Marie says. Yes, I can. I can definitely do this, says Karen. So we can do it. Let's, let's awesome. uh, move on to the next step. Who's ready to see the next step here? Lots of information, great information. This is why I told you to grab a pen and grab a stack of paper because we're, we're, we're yeah. giving you some, <laughs> some info and we're, uh, we're making sure that you learn some stuff here. Yeah, good. So this is, so guys, just to recap, that was research, that's research too. So once we found our research, and let me use, I'm going to use our raised garden bed example that we just found with 12,000 or so people searching. So from, let's say that that was the one we went with and this is what we're moving on with. So here's next step two. So once we've done our research, and remember it's a three-step system. So one is research, two is create the content, right? Once we've found our, we've done our research and we found a great um, killer money-making title like how to build the raised garden bed that's it that's what we make our decision on where do we go from there well there are two ways that we can create our content to sell and I know Ty's used both I have actually only done one of these and a hybrid of one so I'll show you exactly what these are basically first of all and this is my preferred option here and I know uh, for you as well, Ty, uh, is to get someone else to write it. You know, I don't do any of my own writing, guys. Um, I use this option a lot, and I paid as little as fifty dollars to have someone write content for me. For example, that how to build a raised garden bed. That's a pretty simple topic to do. You know, pretty much anybody could do some research on that and write a write a book on it. It's not hard. It's not rocket science for sure. So you can hire someone for literally as little as 50 bucks to go and write that content for you. And the best part is you own 100% of the rights to that content and you can sell it as long and as often as you want. And uh, you can either put your name on it or you can use a pen name. You don't have to use your own name. Um, of course, so sometimes you may want to. Let's say if it was if you were using it for branding for your own for your own uh, business. Let's say you're an expert in something. Say you're an expert in uh, yoga. You're a yoga expert, and you want to write a book on yoga, right? Then you might want to use your own name. 
Uh, but if you were doing books on yoga and then you did one on gardening and then you did one in uh, how to become a better tennis player or how to improve your forehand or golf swing or swimming or whatever it is, um, basket weaving, who knows? <laughs> you could, uh, you, you may want to use a, use a pen name and Amazon lets you do that. You don't have to use your own name as well. So uh, you can use a pen name. So that's, guys, that's my option. I mean, that's the one I recommend. Uh, I recommend outsourcing. In fact, you can outsource this entire business. Um, so to do that, you just go to to the sites I use are odesk.com or you can use Elance, but I personally prefer Odesk. So you want to write that down. It's odesk.com. Now, Odesk, just to give you a quick overview, because I don't really have time to go into uh, show you the ins and outs of Odesk right now, um, but it's very simple. It's basically a job site where you have people that want to do service jobs, kind of like uh, website development, uh, writing, graphic design work. Um, programming that type of stuff on there and it's uh you can pretty much find anyone to do anything on there but we want you know we can post a job on there so we could go there right now and post a job saying i need someone to write me a book on how to build a raised garden bed and i guarantee you within an hour you would have people um offering to write that book for you now some people are going to charge different amounts but you can negotiate and like i said i'd probably pay 50 bucks to get that book written um and of course it's worth it i mean think back to um Let's say, you know, how to build a raised garden bed. You've got 12,000 people every month searching for your book. And you know that that's happening every single month. New people, 12,000 new people are searching for your book. So if you price it, say one of the examples we showed you was like seven ninety nine, And uh, I mean, how many, it wouldn't take, it's not going to take very many sales in a month out of those 12,000 people to make back your 50 bucks plus a whole lot more. Right, and then of course everything after that fifty is all profit. You know, it's all profit, and it's uh, and Odesk is free to use as well, guys. You just pay the person. So um, again, all free tools. So that's the easiest way to go. That's what I recommend. Uh, you know, just pay for it if you want to scale this up, and you know, you know, start creating books as you definitely will once you get into this. Um, that's the way to go. But if you are a writer, now you may be a writer yourself and just love writing, which is fine. My wife loves to write. She's a fantastic writer. She's a very talented writer. For, you know, I'm not, I can't do it at all. I'm dyslexic. I, don't, I barely have turned the ever put pen to paper. But the, um, you know, my wife, on the other hand, does fantastic writing. Um, so if you want to do that, that's fine. That's a perfect option for you. And you can write them yourself. And I'm going to talk about what basically, what formatting, and what document to actually write this in. Um, now, there is one slight hybrid that you could do. So let's say you are the expert in the topic. So let's use that yoga example. So you are a yoga expert, but you're not a good writer. So you're an expert on the topic of yoga, but you're like me, maybe you're dyslexic or you just, you know, you don't really do a whole lot of writing and you don't like writing even. Um, so what do you do then? Because you might not want to outsource it to someone else. You want it to be your information, but you don't want to have to write the book. Well, what you can do is you can actually um, dictate the book. So you could literally say, I'd write out like 12 topics. So, to, or you put your overall topic, which would be yoga or a certain type of yoga. And then you could write 12 subtopics, you know, different stretches to do different parts of the body, whatever it is. And then basically what you do is you just talk into your computer. Now, Ty, I think you, there is a built-in voice recorder into the PC, isn't there? Yeah, absolutely. Most people don't realize that there's a voice recognition program uh, on your PC, but if you go down to your Windows button on the lower left hand side, right, and then click start, and then in your search bar, if you type in speech recognition, you'll see a piece of software that pops up, and you can actually use that to speak into. And then once you have that audio, you can you can go in and give it to someone and have them transcribe it. You can even give it to uh, there's great services out there. There's like a service. Um, called rev.com that you can use and they'll transcribe it. So uh, three different ways to get your content written. Either you can write it yourself, you can hire someone and outsource it, right, which is what I do 99.9% .9 of the time, or you can speak it into a speech recognition program like the one that's found free on most PC computers or something like Dragon Naturally Speaking, and then you can have someone transcribe it for you. Tom says he has it on his smartphone also. Awesome. 
Yeah. So guys, creating the content, the reason I say show you that is there's no need to get hung up on this. I mean, there's really, really not. Once you've found that research, if you do your research right, um, I would honestly say, you know, unless it's you're a passionate writer, even if you can write, but you're not, it's not your passion and, you know, it's not your passion, hey, outsource it. For 50 bucks to be able to outsource a book that potentially can is going to make you hundreds of dollars month after month, I mean, you'd be crazy not to, right? So that's my that's my personal my personal stance on it. But guys, you know, really don't let that hold you back. And if you can't, if you don't want to spend the 50 bucks, then just dictate it, right? You just dictate the book and then have go to Odesk and have someone transcribe it and make it look nice and sound like a book. Simple as that. Really, really not hard. Don't let this be a sticking point for you. That's it. You know, get it created. Now, if you outsource it to someone, um, usually for something like that, how to build a raised garden bed, they'll have that turned around to you and back within about four days usually. So literally four days from right now, you can have your first book ready to publish after this webinar. Four days from now. Think about that. Four days from now. You're so close to this. Um, even if you don't want to write it yourself. If you're a writer, you could bang it out tonight. And you know, get it done tonight, but um, or today, wherever you are in the world, wherever you're listening to this. But anyway, so create the content. That's step two. And then finally, we just got step three, um, which is to basically publish the book yourself. Now, this literally takes five to ten minutes to actually publish a book. Um, you basically just got to create your account for the first time and then add a book to it. It's dead easy. Um, and I'm going to talk about some key points um, and give you the website to do this uh, right now. So, by the way, is this good stuff, guys? Are you guys getting a lot of value from this? Is this, uh, is this uh, valuable stuff? Are you taking lots of notes here? Give me an I can do, the, give me an I can do this in the, uh, in the chat box again for me. Great value. Very good, says Tom. Super, says Anne-Marie. Fantastic, says Pervin. Love it, says Karen. Loving it, Eddie. Wow, and yes, says Ansela. Great stuff, says Chance. Great info, says Deb. Tons of notes, says Re Rebecca. Absolutely, I can do this, says Rose. Yes, loving it, says Sin. Great stuff. Yes, thank you. Ready to rock, says Herman. I can do this. Thank you so much, says Carrie. Awesome, says Sharon. Yes, very valuable. Love it, says Emmanuel. Yes, waiting for... V cell says Jim. Blown away. Thanks, says Joe. It sounds too easy, says Tom. Yes, it, it actually is, Tom. It's one, two, three easy, right? Uh, I can do this right now. Love to get testimonials of people following this seminar who get results from this seminar. And yes, it's great, says Jan. Absolutely. Awesome. And it is. It's um it is fantastic. Oh, Jan, like Jane, we have 600 plus people that are doing absolutely well with this, and we're going to show you. It's part of. They're all part of our Facebook group, okay? And and once you become a part of this program, you'll also become part of that Facebook group as well. And Tom is going to actually take us into that Facebook group, so you could see all of the different members. And I mean, we've got people that are doing extremely well with this thing, from a couple of hundred dollars to a month to a, a, a month. I'm sorry, a couple of thousand dollars a month and we have one gentleman from Perth, Australia named Darren DeVry that's doing about $22,000 a month and he just told me that he's teaching his 67 year old father how to do this and his father is now making $3,000 a month so that's it so let's let's keep going Tom yeah just keep rock and rolling here because I've um, still got st plenty of stuff to share with you guys so uh, let's uh, jump on to the next part so we're on publishing now with the three step system and uh, it's like you know it's like Ty said you know this is this is simple it's, you rinse and repeat this guys this is someone said it's promising yeah I mean if as long as you do this once and just repeat it over and over again you that's all that we do so you're getting the keys to the kingdom here um, all right so the final step is to publish it and we use the site called Kindle direct publishing. Now, the site is kdp.amazon.com, kdp.amazon.com, okay, kdp.amazon.com. Now, if you already have an Amazon account, you can actually uh, sign up with your current account. So you can just log in with your uh, current account, and basically, they're just going to ask you um, for your details. You know, they'll ask what country you're in. You can do this from any country in the world. They will give you, there is not a country that we have found on there that you cannot sign up for this from, okay? So you can publish from any country in the world. So you just go through and select where, what country you're in, give them your details. Uh, takes five, literally five minutes to fill out the form, and that's it. That's the, the account is set up, and now you're officially able to publish on Amazon.com. 
uh, which is the Kindle through the Kindle Direct Publishing. So, how do we actually publish the book? So, let's say you know we've done our research, we found our How to Build a Raised Garden book. We've then gone to Odesk and we've had someone create, spent 50 bucks, had someone create the book for us uh, on Odesk. So what do we do next to publish it? Once we've set up our Amazon account, we then go to a tab within our account that just says new title. I mean, that's all you're going to say. It's going to look very blank when you first get in there because you're not going to have any books in there uh, when you first sign up. So you're just going to hit a tab that says add new title. And Amazon has narrowed, has made this so easy to do. It's a seven-step process. Um, and this is how easy it is. What do you think step one is? Enter your title here. <laughs> that is just about as difficult as it gets. Oh, what's my title? Type your title in. Next, what is your description? Type in your description. Um, it's They have literally made it that easy. Like Ty said, you know, his 14-year-old daughter um, is able to bust through this stuff. And uh, they made it really easy. So what's important, though, is some of the things. So the description. That you, all you have to do is type in your description. It's that easy. But here is some ninja tips for you. Because they give you 4,000 characters for your description. That's how long your description can be. Now, you don't have to use that. For, you don't have to use the 4,000 uh, 4, characters. But this is your chance to really sell your book. Okay, so what I mean by sell is not you don't have to literally sell it, but you your potential prospect is looking at your book. They're already there. This is the last your last little maybe push over the edge when they're going to buy the book. So how do we do this? Well, if you were to let's say you're doing fiction books, let's talk about fiction books for a second. You could do you could talk about the character development, right? Um, if you've got a couple of characters in the story, you could write mini stories about those characters, you know, and their backstories. That would be a great description. It's a chance to get them hooked into the book before they've actually purchased. So um, the people that use the description wisely and properly, um, you're, you're going to outsell your competition competition massively. Um, so again, you could use it as a prelog. You could write a prelog in the description. Um, if it's the how-to book, you could um, talk about the benefits. Of why they're going to get the book. So, if it, let's say you were talking about three exercises to cure back pain, three three ancient Chinese stretches that will cure 90% of back pain, right? That could be an ebook. So, um, you're going to talk about the benefits of why that book. Think about, you know, think about how what life will be like when you can throw a football with your son again or something like that. You know, that's the benefit of what they'll get from curing the back pain and reading the book. So, use that description. Um, you know, as as much as you can. That's a really good tip. Uh, next up, the cover. So you're then going to uh, enter. They'll ask you to upload your book cover. Now your book cover is just going to be a photo. Is basically a JPEG uh, format, which is nothing more than basically an image, like a photo a camera takes. So it's just the most basic standard um, imaging. Like if you've ever uploaded a picture to Facebook. If you've ever uploaded a picture to Facebook, that is exactly the same thing. Okay, so that's all you have to do. Now, here is a really good tip, though, for your covers. Again, you, you can outsource the covers. Don't try and do them yourself. Use Odesk or whatever you want to use. Um, but get more than one done because, again, you want to test your covers. This will make a dramatic difference. And um, I can't tell you how many times I've done this. I've had a couple of covers created, different covers created, and... The sales will come in for one, and I'm like, oh, I love that cover, and I'll use that one first, and then I, you know, two weeks later, I'll change the cover to a new one to see if it converts better, and I'll double my sales of that book. And it's so annoying because it's very rarely the one that I love the most, so I don't know what that says about me personally. <laughs> I don't know. A, I'm an outlier. Maybe I'm a contrarian. I don't really know, but the, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's not my... Uh, it's never the one I like the most. So you always want to test your covers. That's a really, really good tip as well. And then we have formatting. Now, the formatting of your uh, formatting, for those of you that want to write this yourself or you're hiring someone, um, it's just a Word document, like a Microsoft Word document. Um, that's all you need. And uh, what we'll do is Amazon will then convert it for you. So you literally just um, upload the file. So you just double click on the file, upload it, upload the Word document once it's saved, and it will convert it for you. So you don't have to worry about conversions. People 
I've seen people pay like a thousand bucks to have their books converted and there's just no need to do that. Amazon will convert it for you. Now, also, I promised you to give you a price point, um, which was the one of the best price points is that we've tested, which is uh, 597. Now, this changes from time to time um, as the market changes, right? So uh, it used to be a bit higher than this. Um, now it's come down. But a lot of people are charging $2.99 for their books, right? That's a really common price. Um, you're going to lose money if you charge $2.99. Um, you want to, it's basic human nature. If we see something that's priced higher, we automatically think it's worth more money. It's basic psychology. P advertisers have been using that trick uh, for years. And it's true. So don't devalue what you're doing. Plus, um, you can make money because you don't actually actually have to sell a book. I don't know if you re you probably know this, but you don't actually have to sell a single book on Amazon to make money. Amazon has a thing called the lending library, and if you create a book and Amazon lends it to a customer, the customer gets it for free, but Amazon will pay you for allowing them to lend it out. So what book would you choose? Would you, If you were able to get a free gift of some description, are you going to take the gift that's worth a dollar or the gift that you think is worth six bucks? You're going to take the one that's six bucks because you want to get the most value for your money, right? So what happens is, is you're going to get so many more people borrowing your book from Amazon and Amazon paying you for it, that you will make so much more money than everyone else on that front. So again, really, really ninja tip there. So charge more of your books, you will make a lot more money all around. Uh, and 597 has been a great price point. Again, you want to test this yourself, you can change the price of your books, it's not set in stone, but that's a really, really good starting point. So. And uh, so that's it, guys. And then what we do is we just rinse and repeat the process. Um, you know, once those three steps are done, we just rinse and repeat the process. Research, create content, and publish the books. Now, the thing to remember is, is that Amazon wants you to make as much money as possible. Amazon wants you to make as much money as possible because up till now, I don't know if any of you have caught on to this, but Amazon hasn't actually made any money. The publishing platform's free, you know, everything's been free so far. So how does Amazon make money? They only make money when you sell a book. They only make money when you sell a book. Absolutely. And that, that's a good point, Tom. They absolutely want you to make money because, think about it, every time you make money, what does that mean? What does that mean for Amazon? Every time one of your titles sell and you make money, uh, what happens there? Let's see who gets it first. So when you make money, Amazon makes money. Absolutely right. So if you said Amazon makes money, you got it right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, Amazon makes money. And it's such an important thing to remember because that's um, there isn't anything else out there that I know where you can have a 800-pound gorilla. I mean, if there's two 800-pound gorillas of the internet, it's Google. Well, I suppose there's three now. Google, Facebook, and Amazon, right? They're the, those are the... Um, the uh, oh, I forget the name I was after then um, from Terminator movies, but they're uh, Skynet. I don't know if anyone remembers the Terminator movies, but Skynet was the company that created the artificial intelligence that caused the whole apocalypse, whatever. Anyway, <laughs> so you know those are Skynet, you know, of the internet, and uh, very rarely do you have an opportunity where they actually want you to succeed. You know, where they're actually they're actually putting their money behind the little man. Right, they're backing the little man, which is uh, which is uh, which is very very rare. So Amazon actually wants us to make as much money as possible, which is um, which I think is fantastic. It's a really unique opportunity because of that. Now, just to show you, according to Forrester's research, nearly three billion dollars worth of books were sold last year alone. Now. If you look at the statistics we talked about, you know, you had John Locke, um, Amanda Hocking, um, you know, all these people, all this money has been made, all these success stories have come, um, you know, and last year it was $3 billion worth of books were sold on, uh, e-books were sold. That number is expected to jump to $10 billion in the next couple of years. $10 billion. So, 
just think about how many more millionaires are going to be created from this and how many amazing success stories are going to come from this over the next couple of years. So this, you are learning this stuff. You are getting this down here on the ground floor. I mean, this is just, I mean, we have barely scratched the surface of the, uh, of what this is, of what this is going to be. So again, you guys taking action on what we've shown you today. Um, you're positioning yourself over the next couple of years to get a, a really nice piece of this $10 billion pie. Now, um, you can see here, this is just a quick, uh, quick screenshot here. Um, of the monthly revenue that came, comes in from Amazon here. So you can see this, uh, there are three payments here from Amazon. One was for 493 bucks, one was for uh, $23,386, and one for 5506 Now the reason that there were three, and you'll get paid, you'll see multiple payments come in from Amazon when you start doing this, because um, they come from different countries, so depending on what countries your books are being purchased in, uh, you'll get different payments. So uh, I believe this blue one here is uh, German sales, which is $493, just from Germany alone, uh, $493. Then you, the U.S. sales. Now, your U.S. sales will always be your biggest, guys. Your U.S. sales will always be your biggest. At uh, and of course, the, right here it's twenty three thousand, and then the five thousand was from the UK, UK sales. And guys, that comes in month after month, like or on autopilot almost. It's pretty, <clears throat> it's pretty amazing. But I mean, this is an incredible amount of money. But for a second, just uh, something interesting. My wife, um, my wife was uh, looking for a new car. She wants a new car. So I'm not really into flashy cars, but she wanted one, so she wants a nice car. We'll get a nice car, and uh, we're having a look and. Um, I was looking at like Audis and Mercedes and BMW, so nothing, no Ferraris or anything like that, but still nice cars. It was amazing. I found that you can actually, for for about 500 bucks a month, you can pretty much uh, finance any of those cars, brand new. Mercedes, Audi, BMW, any of those nice cars, you can finance for 500 bucks a month, brand new. And... It made me chuckle because that's like, you know, just a couple of ebooks. Just, you are literally, I would say, just a couple of ebooks and I can pay for that car. You know, it's really quite incredible the opportunity here. So, uh, as much as I know, you know, you may be sitting here thinking, God, I, I just want to make a few hundred bucks, let alone, you know, 30,000. Well, you know, you're a lot closer to that than, uh, than you think. And as you've just seen, you know, just a few half decent selling titles and you can, literally can be life changing. I mean, it doesn't take much. I think, I think most people, there was a study done. And I think most people said that, you know, just a thousand bucks a month, um, extra would be a significant amount of enough money to really make a substantial change in lifestyle for them. Um, but imagine if you had 9, 10, 11, even 20 of these books. You know, we've shown you John Locke. He had nine titles and he sold a combined million copies in under a year. So <clears throat> Just out of interest, you know what? You know what would you? What do you? What would you guys do with income? It always fascinates me. You know, I love I love traveling. You know, Ty and I travel a lot together. Um, you know, we were able to start a business. You know, we have an app company. We develop apps and games for the um, iPhones and Androids and stuff. And it's created some amazing opportunities for us. But I'm always fascinated to see. You know, what would you guys do with? You know, with an extra thousand, two thousand dollars a month, three thousand, thirty thousand. What would you do? What do you guys do? Ty, what do they Travel do? and buy investment says Frida. Move to a beachfront property in Brazil. B uh, Belize says Queen. Uh, pay off my mortgage. Pay for my daughter's college says Pervin. Travel, retire. My husband says Rose. Uh, let's see. Pay off some debt. Then invest says Nick. Relax says Jill. Vacation for a year around the globe says Tom. Retire my mother says Angela. That's awesome. Uh, start my own business, Karen. That's what Tom and I have done. We've started multiple businesses. I uh, wish to help others, homeless people, build a fantastic drug. We, we have helped mentally ill. That's awesome, Jane, as well. Uh, start my new life, says Kit Kat. Move to Costa Rica, says Rebecca. Uh, open an orphanage, says Joe. Uh, travel, pay off bills, start multiple businesses, says Deb. Travel more, community service, and humanitarian projects, says Sin. Pay debt, settle for a vacation, start a great life, says Emmanuel. And help myself first, says Jane as well.
Awesome, good yeah. stuff. And the, the traveling thing, you know, I love the travel and uh, Manuel said pay off debt. That was the first thing, you know, the first thing I did was pay off the debt. And yeah, it's huge. But uh, there's an interesting story as well with traveling. Uh, I mean, that's one of the things this does is it gives you the freedom to be able to travel, right? I mean, you can do this from anywhere. You can literally run this business from your phone. Um, you could go onto Odesk on your phone, do some research, type in, you know, type up the job, post it on Odesk and literally it can all be run from your cell phone, literally. Um, in fact, uh, as one of the... Um, students was telling us how they um, were doing a round the world trip, traveling around the world, and each place they went to, they um, stayed there for a couple of weeks and they took notes on where they were, the best places to eat, um, where to avoid, if there are any places to avoid, the negative side of it, you know, um, the really hidden gems of the city and the place they went. And each place they went, they uploaded a book to the Amazon store, like a tourist guide. Um, and by halfway around this round the world trip, he had already paid for his entire vacation. Halfway around, the whole thing had already been paid for, um, off of the sales alone. Plus, obviously, each case he was going to carry on doing it. And once those books were there, I mean, um, he'll probably be set for life just off of those books that he did while he was traveling. So, um, you know, anything's potential. You just got to sort of uh, open your mind. But anywhere you want to go, you can run this business from your phone or your iPad, uh, whatever it is. So, pretty. All those things are possible, you know, that you guys have all put in there. It's absolutely true and really obtainable. You can definitely do this. I know you can. Um, now, the beautiful thing about about um, making money on Amazon is, as you've seen, it, the amount grows, you know, month after month with very little even additional work on your part. You know, once you've done that work the first time, that's it. Um, you don't have to do anything else to that book. I mean, once it's uploaded, it's uploaded. You can do a bit of testing, you know, like I suggested, testing the cover. But, I mean, that's easy. It takes two minutes to do that. So, you know, once that work's done, it's done. Um, the work that Ty did to get those checks, you know, those first checks was done one time and yet, you know, still continue to get paid month after month for that work that was done that first time. So if you want to make more money, you simply just take a few minutes to add some more titles, right? Like I said, you can do it from your phone anywhere you like. Starbucks. In fact, I spend most of my time um, in Starbucks, you know, drinking coffee, spending a lot of my money on coffee and apple strudels, uh, apple, is it the apple, apple fritter. I'm obsessed with the Starbucks apple fritter at the moment. So anyway, but yeah, so you can do this stuff from Starbucks anywhere you like. In fact, we have lots of our students uh, um, that are really, you know, enjoying this and there are, and I'll show you this uh, amazing Facebook group um, that we've got now. Would you guys like to have a quick look at the Facebook group? Would you guys like to see that and see, you know, show you sort of, see some of the other people that are in our Facebook group that are doing this? Sure, yes please, lots of yeses coming in, awesome. Cool, all right, well, I'll show you very quickly, we'll go through, just to very quickly give you a quick cap, and of course then if you have any questions about it at the end, we can of course uh, do that. So let's see if I, hopefully I don't blow up go to webinar here. Um, okay, I thought you might, so, oh, my wife is sending, how to train your brain and multitask. Apparently, my wife is sending me that, <laughs> posting that on Facebook right now. But anyway, anyway, guys, this is me, by the way. So come and find me, you know, real person. And here's Ty. You can see, and this is our Kindle group, right? So this is an amazing group. We've got uh, 526 members in here. Um, now, these are all people, students of this program. And obviously, you've learned the stuff we're showing you is the system that um, Ty teaches, this Kindle cash flow system. This is where it all comes from. Um, and we're all part of this community. It's just wonderful. And, um, you know, Ty's in here posting. And um, this is a post that I did. And we're constantly in here, you know, supporting and giving advice. And uh, I actually, this right here, uh, so as you can see from the title, I, put you, I totally give you permission to steal this from me. I stumbled across an amazing way to get people to post jobs on Craigslist and get people to write the content for you from Craigslist. And um, you can see here, I, I went into great detail about what you can, uh, what I found and um, the, steps you, the steps you can go through. I even gave the exact uh, template here that... Um, I used for the job posting and all that type of stuff. And so it's good comments and stuff. And we all get in there and get involved, guys. So, um, yeah, it's just really good fun. I mean, it's good, isn't it, Ty, our group? Yeah, absolutely. I just had myself muted for a second there. But, but it's, it's good. It's good being able to see everyone interact with each other. It's good. To Ty, you sound quite far away. You're, you're quite quiet. Uh oh, there we go. Yep, it's good to see everyone interacting with each other. And what's, what's even better is it's good seeing new people come in 
and going through the process and then getting used to the system, asking questions and getting help. Because with this program, you're never left alone, right? It's one big family. And it's good to see people, you know, coming in new and starting to publish their books, starting to get some traction, making money, and then getting to the next level. So it's just awesome. Yeah, in, fact, the group, in fact, that's yeah. a great example right here. Paula, uh, Paula has, uh, Paula's quite new to the group, and she, she's just got her, uh, one of her books up there, How to Write a Cover Letter um, for Job Applications. And the great thing about this is, is the great thing about this group is that you can post your books in here and we'll critique them for you. So, you know, you're not on your own. You can, you know, if you have questions or can't think of a title, but look, she's used the title enhancer in here, how to, so very good, um, how to write a cover letter. So, and as you see, that's just nine yeah, hours just, ago. You know, so we're always in yeah, here. That was, yeah, we're always in here and uh, posting. Uh, Julie, she's done brilliantly. She does like, um, what's, uh, she does books for, uh, she does like quiz books, children's quiz books. And she's done incredibly well with that um, yeah. and made, the, you know, a ton of money with that. And there's just um, all sorts of options, guys. It doesn't have to be, you know, we showed you the how-to stuff, but don't let that, you know, how to build a race on It doesn't have to be that. Um, you can really go into any market. Um, any market you like. So, anyway, just thought that'd be nice to sort of share that with you and show you, um, show you sort of the community and um, that you're not alone. That this stuff really does work. It's just average, normal people. Like, not you know, there's not rocket science. It's just you know, really normal, average people. Um, well, special people in their own way, but not you know, they don't. Uh, like me, for example, I don't have any, you know, pre-existing talents as far as writing or computer skills go, and you can still, anyone, you know, can really succeed with this. So, now, I do want to say, though, although I'm going, you know, Ty and I are talking about how easy this is, I've got to say, there's no such thing as a, a get-rich-quick push-button system. I mean, anyone who tells you there is, is lying, I'd run a mile, and if that's what you're looking for, then... Um, you know, Kindle publishing probably isn't for you because, uh, you know, you do have to do the work. I mean, you've got to do the research, the content, and publish the content and do the publishing. Um, so if that seems like too much work for you, then probably I would look for maybe something else. But um, as far as <laughs> online, as far as online businesses go, I think, uh, <clears throat> you know, I think this is, like I said, you can run this from, from a beach from your iPad, you can literally run this from anywhere in the world, from beach from your iPad. So I think this is as close as it gets to a uh, <laughs> to a push button system. I don't know about you. What do you think, Ty? You think about? Would you agree with that? Absolutely, I agree. And I, and, I, and I like the fact that you know, as a lot of our students do as well, that it's tying you into a multi-billion-dollar, very reputable, highly reputable company as well. So yeah, it's it's um, it just works with, really well. It, the other thing I want to know, we have a ton of questions that are coming in, and I'm answering a lot behind the scenes, but we are going to answer every single question in just a few moments. We're going to answer them live. We're going to have a, a Q&A where we'll read over the questions. And So if you have any questions, please go in and ask them right now. Post them into your questions box. And remember, there's no such thing as a dumb question, okay? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. There really isn't any such thing as a dumb question. So please don't be scared to ask, and um, we'll answer them all at the end. Otherwise, uh, and uh, so that if uh, anyone has to dive off, they can. But we, yeah, we're going to absolutely have a good Q and A at the end. So uh, anyone can join this program as well. We said this a number of times, but I think I saw a question in there about this. Um, this is not the Amazon Associates program. If you don't know what that is, don't even worry about it. But I did see someone ask this. Um, this is not the Amazon Associates program. This is their Kindle Direct Publishing program that anyone can join. It doesn't matter what country you're in or what state you're in. Um, you can be anywhere in the US, anywhere in the world, and you'll still get 70% royalties. So um, the out of that money, so let's say for the 597, let's say you price your books 597, you keep 70% of that when they sell. I mean, that's why we are able to make so much money from this, is because we've got all those people searching and the sales coming in, and you get to keep 70% of the royalties for the, uh, for the, uh, for the troubles. Now, I have no problem paying Amazon that 30%, right? I don't mind. And here are some of the reasons why. Because you don't have to worry about traffic, right? Because Amazon, we, we're using Amazon's traffic. Like Amazon gets all the traffic, Amazon gets all the visitors, so we get to use their traffic. So we don't have to worry about that. There's no order taking. Amazon handles it all. There's no customer service issues. There's no shipping of orders. There's no merchant accounts. There's no PayPal issues or headaches. There's no chasing prospects or customers. 
cards. And Amazon has over 300 million credit cards on file. So these are the reasons why I'm very happy, and I think you should be as well, to happily pay them that 30% royalty. And we still get to keep, even after all that, they still let us keep 70%, which compared to regular publishing, if you were to like publish an actual physical book with a, like say Simon & Huster or Penguin Publishing House, um, for a $24 book, you would probably get a dollar of that. Whereas with this, we get to keep 70% and we don't have to worry about all those other headaches and handles. So, and again, Amazon makes this incredibly easy for us to do, for you to do, because to make money with. And the reason why, why do Amazon make it really easy for us? Because they don't make money unless you make money. So it's easy for you to get started. They've made it easy for that. They make it so that you, limited skill is required. There's a monthly recurring income stream. Why? Because Amazon wants monthly recurring income stream. Right? They want to. They're going to keep selling month after month if you've got a good book because they want the money. So again, it's a win-win uh, for us all. You don't need to know how to build a website, a blog, or any of that. You don't have to do any of that stuff. Um, Amazon handles all the order taking, the fulfillment, the customer service, the returns, anything like that. And you can sign up no matter where you live. And like I said, we still get to keep that massive 70% of the uh, royalty uh, every single month. And as you've seen, it only takes a few books to, uh, to really make a lot of money with this. So anyway, I am sure that there are lots of you that are now wondering, okay, how can I learn more about this? You know, there's only so much we can cram into this, and I'm sure you've got a ton of, I know you've got a ton of value from this, but uh, of course, anyone who wants to continue uh, on this and really take this to the next level, then um, you're going to want to uh, invest into Ty's course, which is the Kindle Cashflow, which is the group we just showed you. So uh, talk for a little bit about who this course is for. Basically, this is for anyone who's, um, looking for an easy way to make money. Um, this is the course that I went through. This is what got me here talking with you now and having the privilege to be here talking now. Um, it doesn't matter if you've never sold anything in your life. It doesn't matter if you've got an eighth grade education. You know, Ty's 14 year old daughter does this. I said it's got 13 on there, but she's actually 14 now. Um, that's how I said, I think around $4,000 a month. So if you have family members, you know, you can do this, sit down and go through this training with the family. It doesn't just have to be you on the computer. It could be you and the family. Like my wife gets involved. My wife and I are going to do a series of children's books together as well. So you can do this with the whole family. I think it's fantastic. Uh, it doesn't matter if you've got limited experience, limited internet access, limited time, or even money. Um, you can still do really, really well with this. It doesn't matter if you hate writing. I mean, like I said, I don't do any of my own writing. I've got no technical skills. So if you have, if you struggle with any of that stuff, you're still going to be able to um, have have the success you deserve. Um, whereas some of the other things you may not be able to do. So it doesn't matter if you live outside a country, uh, outside the United States. We literally, as you, in that Facebook group, you can see we literally have people from all over the globe that are making amazing um, living from this and. Um, life-changing amounts of money really. So what we've done is we've put together a very complete course that shows you step-by-step -step how Ty grew his Amazon Kindle publishing account from nothing, as you saw at the beginning, to over $30,000 a month. And uh, as you saw from those checks at the start, it was done in just a few months' time that we was able to do that, and you can too. So Ty's gonna drop his guard and show you uh, every single thing that we've learned about making unheard of amounts of money uh, by publishing material to the Kindle. Uh, so here's some of the things you're gonna get. You're gonna show, we're gonna show you how to find topics with high demand. Okay, find topics with high demand. We've tested dozens of different topics over the months and we have a list of the best ones. We've literally done the work for you. So these topics sell like crazy and make money fast. We're gonna give these to you um, so that literally you can go in there and make money really quickly so you don't have to do a, uh, waste time on a lot of research. You can have success right away. So you're gonna get this entire list of money making ideas. We're also going to show you how to pick the best way to go, whether it be hiring a ghostwriter or an outsourcer to write it for you, or you want to write it yourself. Either way, um, you know, if you want to get someone else to write the content for you, uh, like I do and Ty does, if so, we're going to show you the right and the wrong way to go about doing this. Now, there is a wrong way you can do this. Um, we want to make sure that you own 100% of the rights to the book that someone else writes. This is really, really important, and a lot of people screw this up 
big time. So we're going to make sure you don't screw this up. So it's smooth sailing for you and you can have success right away. Uh, or if you want to do it yourself and choose to write your own content, which is great, um, we'll give you pre-formatted template um, that makes the whole process of writing really easy. You just drop your content in there, write your content in there, follow the steps, step by step, and you'll get your material approved every single time without delay, no problems. Uh, it's literally just fill in the blanks and go. So either way you want to go, we've got you covered. We're going to make sure you get up and running really, really quickly. Then we're going to show you some simple strategies that Ty taught one of his buddies that is now making him nearly $4,000 a month from two to three page reports. Two to three page reports. Now, guys, even I could write a two or three page report on a topic, <laughs> and I don't like to write. So, you know, if you're worried about length and stuff, doesn't worry about that. $4,000 a month. We're going to give you this exact strategy. Um, this is super easy. Again, he's got his kids doing this as well. I'm going to show you how to find what people want to buy. Now, the easiest way to make money online is by finding out what people want to buy first. Right? We find out what they want to buy first and then sell it to them. We're going to show you exactly how that is done. There are some sneaky secret websites that we use to do this. We're going to give those to you as well so you can go right in and do that. We're going to show you how to create best-selling titles and descriptions. Remember, I said there were three things, title, description, and cover. Well, we're going to show you how to create the best-selling titles, descriptions that are going to draw mega attention to your eBooks and make people want to buy your stuff over everything else they see on Amazon. Um, again, this is extremely powerful. Um, we're going to teach you this so that, again, you can get make money straight away with this and outsell any competition that you have in the Amazon store. Then we're going to show you to piece this all together and show you how to get super professional covers created, just like the ones you see here for 5 to 10 dollars just five or ten dollars now some people pay hundreds of dollars to have covers created uh, which are less quality than this and uh, simply because they just don't know any better so again you can get covers created like this like we do for five to ten bucks we're going to share all those secrets with you plus more simple tips that we use for picking what content to sell on Amazon now this one this one method tripled tie sales from three thousand to eight thousand in those checks this one simple strategy was applied that uh, we found you can go in, you're going to get that as well, so you can apply it immediately to your books. We're also going to share with you the stupid Amazon.com mistakes. Now, these are mistakes that we see people making every day that will cause you to lose money when you try and do this on your own. I mean, we have the we show you these live examples. Um, again, five money losing mistakes that people are making every single day um, on Amazon. Uh, we're going to show you how you can avoid those, uh, making those mistakes, so you can get straight to making money, which is obviously what the ultimate goal of this is. Plus, we're going to give you the entire list of title enhancers. So um, we gave you a few to get you started, but we have an entire list of those title enhancers that you can cherry pick from, add them to the topics that we give you, the list of topics we're giving you, and you guys are going to be good to go. Uh, you just add those to your accounts. Again, remember just a few of those, and a few of those words can literally double and triple your sales. We can give you our entire list. First, we're going to show you how to get hundreds, even thousands of other websites to post links back to your Amazon books, helping you make even more money. Now, this method alone makes thousands of dollars in additional revenue outside of Amazon. Um, Honestly, I'm pretty much just as excited about this as I am about the actual selling of content on Kindle itself. This is a really cool strategy. We can give you that as well. Uh, plus, you get access to the Facebook group, our amazing Facebook group. You know, where you get to ask questions, get updates, share ideas, brainstorm. I shared, you know, I share my ideas, anything, the latest stuff we're testing. Um, and the latest works, we can help you come up with ideas for your covers, uh, critique your covers, come up with headlines, titles, all that good stuff uh, we will help you with in the Facebook group. In fact, I'm pretty proud of the Facebook group. I think we've done an amazing job. And uh, I will, we're constantly asking people you know, in the group how we're doing. Is there anything else we can do better for you? And um, one of the responses we got was this from Lama, and she said, I'd rate this group 9 out of 10. The support offered here is unlike anything I have experienced in any other group on Facebook or in any other social communities during my eight-year journey online as an internet marketer. Everyone here gladly and genuinely shares their knowledge and experience with others without holding anything back. So, Guy, I'm not going to read the entire thing, but she's very kind and thanked a number of people in here. And... Um, She's been online for eight years. Eight years she's been doing this, and she reckons this is her 
best book and uh, Bert came the best best uh, group and support she's found um, and Bert came back in and said I second the comment Lama not sure how you guys brought such support and encouragement in this place but it sure is welcome and this is the key to success guys it's about having a system to follow which you're gonna get and then having people to answer the questions and support you through it and push you through those uh, challenges that we inevitably overcome. We're going to help you there. We're going to hold your hand through this and really make sure that you succeed. So again, just imagine for me being able to upload a tiny ebook. You know, imagine it. We've seen it. You know, that how to build a raised garden bed. Just imagine publishing that right now and without doing any marketing for it. No pay-per-click. You don't have to pay for advertising or anything like that. And that one little book makes you hundreds of dollars a month on autopilot almost automatically once it's set up and then if you want to make more money you know uh, let's say you've got a holiday coming up and you want to pay for that or uh, it could be a kids graduation or kids off to college then you simply add um, make another book add another add another add another until you hit your income goals you take basically take control of your finances here because you just set yourself a target goal of income and just Make as many books as you need to to hit that goal. And then if you hit it, want to make more, just add another. So to wrap things up for you guys, um, I know you're probably anxious to get um, involved with this, and that's great. Uh, so in this course, we show you the entire money-making system, literally, from start to finish. You can literally look over Ty's shoulder as he shows you everything that you'll need to get started as quickly as possible and start making money. Um, we've made this super easy so that everyone especially newbies and beginners can follow along and get quick results that's the most important thing we want to help you get results fast with this and start making money for you really as fast as possible now we have added some amazing bonuses um, to help you do that and we're gonna go through these quickly for you um, basically the first bonus if you order on this webinar now this is only available because you're here with us now these are fast action bonuses, and um, once this is once they're gone, they're gone. Okay, this is there's uh, you have to order on the webinar. You won't be able to find these outside. Um, but for those of you that do, this is going to be awesome because you're going to get the Google Kindle Crunch course. Now, this is going to show you step by step how to get those how to get your books ranked in on the first page of Google. So you know those books we showed you where we were in, on the top of like uh, 5 million results? This is how. We're going to give you the step-by-step -step instructions that anyone can follow to do the same thing. Now, Ty taught this course separately. This was a separate course originally um, that Ty sold for 500 bucks. So you get that included today when you order on the webinar. Plus, you're going to get two additional modules, which is the Facebook module and the YouTube Socializer module. Now, these are amazing ways to get more even more sales of your books so how to basically post you can build a page for your Facebook and get a ton of traffic from Facebook and we'll show you how to create some videos about your books to really get all that traffic the millions of YouTube views and subscribers uh, again to drive massive amounts of traffic to your books and again again you don't need very many books when you're applying these strategies to make a lot of money plus we have four more bonuses for you one is going to be publishing to the Nook and iBooks mini course. Now, the Nook and iBooks is iBooks is Apple's version of Kindle, that's their eBooks, and the Nook is Barnes and Noble. Now, Kindle and Amazon have the market share. They have 80% of the market share, but there's still 20% that's divided up on the Nook and iBooks, uh, which again is Amazon and uh, Barnes and uh, sorry, Apple and Barnes and Noble. So we're going to show you how you can take your book from and from the Kindle and put it onto those devices as well. So you will be on every single device out there. Uh, plus, we're going to give you a bonus of the offline income publisher model. Now, people will pay you a lot of money to do this for them. People will pay you a lot of money. My dentist paid me twelve hundred bucks to uh, publish a book for him. Twelve hundred bucks to publish a book for him. It took well, it didn't even take me. It took my outsourcer probably. 15 minutes to do and it was worth 1200 bucks so guys we're going to show you exactly the system that you can do this for other people and how to get other people um, and get big big paydays from doing this from others as well so you can take all this training and apply it to everyone else plus you're going to get another bonus which is all about turning your books into physical books now this is pretty simple I told you about uh, about 
Fifty Shades of Grey started as a Kindle book. Well, this is how we're going to show you how you can turn yours into a physical book. Um, and just by having a physical book, even if you don't sell them, um, it'll increase your sales because people um, see that there's a physical book as well, lends credibility to your book. We're going to add that in as a bonus as well. Plus, you get the ebook list builder method. Um, now, one of the best ways, again, to make money is people that download your books. People that download your books, you can. We're going to show you how you can get those people onto uh, an email list, an email list, and then you can um, deliver value to them, give them further information, notify them about your future books that you create, um, sell other stuff to them if you want to do that. Um, again, that's a huge in additional income stream. They've already bought from you. They know, like, and trust you. Now you can really build your following and take it to the next level. Uh, we're going to show you the exact way to do this so you get lots and you get tons of people, floods of your uh, customers joining your list as well. And finally, a limited bonus. This is the last bonus, fast action bonus we have. But we have stacked the value up here. But this is for the first 10 people that order. Um, and this is for the, only for 10 people. Uh, and the reason why is we want to give you your very own virtual assistant. Now, some bit, you know, a lot of people, um, you might want to have someone else do it for you, uh, but you're unsure about the outsourcing thing. We're going to show you how that's done in the course. But for, for the first 10 people, we want to actually give you your very own virtual assistant who can upload your books for you. They can do the research for you. They can basically go through the course and implement it for you. Okay, they are ready to go. The only thing they can't do is write the books for you. They can't write them, but they can hire people to write them for you. They can do all of that for you. So if you just if you're like me and you're lazy and you want to sit back and have someone else do it all, make sure you're one of the first people. Uh, first 10 people to order uh, because these will go really quickly. We've got uh, about 200 people on here right now. So I know these are going to go fast. Please get your orders in. This is $600 value. This is a real person, 40 hours that uh, we have to, I say we, Ty's going to pay for <laughs> for you out of his pocket so that you guys can really get off to a flying star if you want someone else to basically just do the work for you. So. To wrap this up, uh, we've got the Google Kindle Crunch bonus, we've got the YouTube, YouTube Facebook Socializer bonuses, we've got the Nook and iBooks mini course, we've got the offline income model bonus you're getting, you're going to get the uh, how to turn your books into physical books, and you're going to get the ebook list builder method, plus your very own virtual assistant for 40 hours for the first 10 people to order. You're going to get all of that when you order as a bonus, plus the actual... Um, course itself delivered to your house in this beautiful uh, home study course with all the DVDs for you and the family to watch. Again, um, that's where Ty sells this outside of this webinar for uh, $1,997, so just under $2,000. Um, plus, you're going to get over $2,000 of bonuses. Um, all of that is included today uh, when you order. So if you guys, uh, so go there now. All you've got to do is I want you to go over to www kindlecash.net forward slash gl go there now go over to www.kindlecash.net forward slash gl tile put it in the chat box and place your orders guys go get in come and join us in this journey um i can't wait to help you have success with this you know ties looking forward to having you in as well um guys this will ship to your house this is your diamond mine all right. Don't let someone else get it before you. Get in there now. www.kindlecash.net forward slash gl. And um, like I said, this is a physical course, guys. You're going to get this to the um, delivered to your house. Uh, so it's home study. So you can literally sit there with the family and watch. So we, yes. Just buddy. really quickly, we have a lot of people that are actually trying to visit the website all at once. So if you're not able to get in. It's just because we have a lot of people that are actually rushing to the site and trying to get their orders in. So if for any reason you're not able to get in, just hit refresh and, and, and keep trying. You should be able to get in afterwards. And once you do place your order, just state your name in the questions box so that we know uh, when to stop at the bonuses because we want to make it fair and, and give those bonuses only to the people that have already purchased. Uh, Jane, no, you would need the course to to have you, to walk you through the entire process of everything that we talked about because we just, you know, because we're limited on time, we just touched the tip of the iceberg here, just the tip of the surface. There's so much more that goes into it, and we cover everything in the course. And Michael says he's in. Donald says he's in. Uh, we've got Nico says I am in as well. All right, so the, 
these questions are flying off the shelf. If you're in, just please state your name in the questions box so we can reserve one of the bonuses for you. And, and Ty, uh, we do, and uh, there's a 100% money back guarantee, isn't there? That's right. It comes with a complete 30 day money back guarantee, and that doesn't start until the day that your course uh, arrives at your doorstep, so whether that's your office or your home. All right, so you have a complete 30 day money back guarantee to try this out, and if you don't like it for any reason, just send it back and we'll issue you a full refund. Uh, we have Thomas. Thomas says he's in. Welcome to the group, Thomas. Uh, let's see, Jane is in as well. Welcome, Jane. Uh, no one, Nick has a question. Nick, we're going to be answering questions in just a moment. We are going to have a really, really detailed Q&A session, so Nick, just hold on. It's not a recording. Nick says, so I guess it's, this is just a recording. No one really answering questions. <laughs> All right, so, no, this is live, buddy. Uh, yeah, this is definitely live because uh, <laughs> you saw my you saw my wife post something live to Facebook there a second ago. So uh, yeah, this is definitely live. Yeah, absolutely. Right. So again, we are running out of those bonuses, and they are coming in on a first come first serve basis. So visit the site now. It is uh, www.kindlecash.net forward slash gl. Yeah, and guys, you can't click the link on the screen, so I think Ty's put it into the chat box for you, so you can go over there and uh, go there now, click the link, and just you know, give it a whirl, guys. If it's for, you know, um, kick the tires with it. If you've liked what you've um, seen on the webinar and you want to really give this a go, then try it. You know, give it a try for the 30 days and come see us immediately. Come and see us in the chat in the Facebook group immediately. We're going to get you off to a rocking start. Like I said, you know, with um, once you've done the research. You can literally have a book up on Amazon in the next few days. I mean, it's that quick if you want it to be. So let's, you know, don't let anything hold you back. Take action now. And uh, like I said, you've got nothing to lose. It's risk free. Just, you know, give it a try. If it's, you know, if it's for you, awesome. We make a lot of money. If not, no problem. You just you send, you can get your 100% money back. So, uh, and in fact, they're flying um, off the shelf. This, this, this is a great group, Tom. They, they see the value in this and they're taking action. I know you're about to play a tel test tel uh, uh, can't speak uh, video testimony in just a moment, but I just want to acknowledge the, the latest uh, courses that just came in. We've got Derek. Derek Pierce is in. We have Sherry. Sherry Adam is in. Uh, we've got Rachel Jones is in. Good to have you. All right, awesome. Okay, so. Go in, place your order so that we can reserve one of these bonuses for you as well. And Tom's going to share a couple of testimonials from some of our current students that are just really rocking this right here. I mean, how much extra money a month can you use to really change things in your life? Take a look at a couple of these testimonials here. All right, let's, uh, yeah, let's fire up these for you guys right here. We also have Thomas. Thomas Orban is in. Uh, Angela and Angelia Linder is in. Good to have you guys in. Awesome, Angela. Good to have okay, you. Okay, I young seem lady. to be having a little bit of a challenge here, guys. I do apologize. I seem to be having a challenge with the videos here. They don't see it's. Uh... Okay, guys. Well, unfortunately, Angela, yes, you actually are in. You are. Uh, you do have the bonuses. Uh, so yes, you are you are in, and uh, let, let's see if I can play the video on my end here. Uh, yeah, if you um, can, if you want to take it over, time, if you if you can get that to play on your end, mate, and then uh, I don't know why see. that's not playing. And then I I'm gonna have to once I do that, I'm gonna have to switch it right back over to you, I think. But let me just check and see. Do you want to see the video testimonials or not? Let's see. Let's let's let the audience, yeah guys. Would you like to see them? You tell uh, us. Do you guys want to get right into Q and A? Do you want to see the video testimonials or do you want to get into the Q and A? Let us know. Uh, Tom, yes, you are in for the bonus. Yep, Tom, you have the bonuses, right? Absolutely. Meg says she wants to uh, Q and A. Let's see who wants to Q and A or, or all right, Q and A says Jim. All right, so they want the Q and A. So let's go over some of these questions that we have here. And uh, again, if you have not placed your order, we do have a few more of the bonuses available. So uh, the link again is KindleCash. Dot net forward slash gl. All right, so let's go over some of the questions here, Tom. If you want to read them off, I'll go in and I'll yeah, Let me just uh, pull them up here. Right, let's have a uh, look at that. So, 
Angela said, just place the order. Yep, you, uh, yep, she's got uh, she's got the VA. Okay, let me scroll back up here, guys. If you if you asked a question earlier, please feel free to repost it now so that it comes in at the bottom again. So if I you know if I'm scrolling up so that I don't miss any of your questions, please um, far away. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, Jane says, I have to make, make some money to pay for the course. Jane, absolutely. You're going to make way more money than that. <laughs> way more money. If you uh, just got to take, you know, take action on it, come and see us. We'll help you get going. You know, just come. If you have any questions at all, hit us up in the Facebook group. You know, that's what it's there for. So you don't have to wait to get this, guys. So anyone that's getting, uh, once this gets delivered to you, you're going to, you know, it'll take a few days to get there because, like I said, it's a home study course. So you get it actually at home. You can watch this with the family. But, you know, you'll get at, you'll get a quick start guide and access to the Facebook group immediately. So you know, we can help you get going right away with this. There's no need to uh, no need to stand on ceremony here. That's, you know, Claudia has a great question. She says, "Can I do this if I'm outside of the United States?" Absolutely, Claudia. You can do. We have students that are literally just placed all over the planet. We have uh, people that are in Australia. We have people that are in South America, Brazil, uh, Canada. Uh, the UK, we have a young lady that's actually in Russia. Uh, we have a gentleman that's, uh, actually, we have several people that's in Germany, uh, Italy, Spain, France. We've got uh, Costa Rica. We have Africa. So you can literally be from any country on the planet and still publish your e ebooks to Amazon's uh, KDP platform and do well with this. All right? So it uh, doesn't matter where you're at right now. And Amazon will pay you um, for your sales, and uh, it's just an awesome way to get started. It's an awesome way to build a business with your family if you have a significant and you're looking to do something together. It's an awesome way to introduce your children to uh, being, you know, self-employed and to being for, to, into being their own person. Uh, Nick says, "I'm in." I just brought Nick. Uh, welcome to the group as well. We've got. Uh, lots of more orders that are coming. Actually, you know what? We have about two more bonuses left. Uh, these orders have been coming in so fast. So if you're on the fence, you want to go in and get one of these. Uh, we have two more bonuses. Uh, we, the entire package. And Tom, can you go over everything that they get with this? So if you want those bonuses, I'm sorry, we, we're coming down to the wire here. There's, we, there's just two more left. This is a physical course, so it's not false scarcity or anything like this these are physical products that get shipped out your course will arrive in the mail and uh, let's see here here's the so just going guys to recap there a couple of people asked again what the bonuses were so just to recap them uh, basically you're going to get the, as the bonuses alone you get the Google Kindle Crunch course. Now that's where we're going to walk you through how you can get your ebooks ranked on that first page of Google so if you think remember back to those um, where I showed you these um, slides right here. Let's just take you back up to the top. Where we talked about, um, I gave you the example. So this example here, where these books were ranked up on the top of Google here, where we again, you know, you got all these placements here. This is we're going to show you exactly how to do this. So if you want to, in the course, we're going to walk you through in that bonus how you can get your books ranked up here with Amazon's name and have make sure you got the reviews and everything showing, and you're up here on the first page of Google for your search term. Now, um, again, outside of Amazon, this is a huge income stream. If then think about it, if you've got you know, over 10,000 people searching for your book and you're just sitting up there month after month, that's an amazing um, income stream. So again, we're going to show you how to do that. So that's in the uh, that's in the, bon the Google Kindle Crunch bonus. And we also have the Facebook and YouTube socializer modules. Now, you don't have to get any traffic outside of um, outside of Amazon, guys. If you don't want to, you don't have to get traffic outside of Amazon. Amazon will promote for you. However, if you if you do want to do a little bit more, you can use Facebook. Facebook's a great way to basically you can become an, an international bestseller by using Facebook effectively with the strategies that we show you. Uh, plus YouTube as well. YouTube's such an amazing way, and no one's doing this. 
No one is using YouTube to promote their books. And we're going to show you how easy it is. You can get a little video created for literally 15 bucks. You can get a video created of your book and an intro to your book and an ad for your book. Get it on YouTube. You'll get thousands of extra uh, people to your books uh, just by doing that. So that's what we're going to cover in the socializer modules. Um, plus the iBooks and Nook mini course. Like I said, you know, Amazon has 80% of the market share. But if you've done the work, you may as well get it out on to every device out there and that's what we're going to show you how to do in this bonus right here and again these were separate courses both the Google Kindle Crunch course and the iBooks mini course that Ty sold individually um, previously off of this webinar for um, for 500 bucks each so you get those included today as well and then like I said the offline income model where you can actually go and do this for people people will pay you a lot of money because when you get published on Amazon you become you are officially it's an you are an internationally published author which is pretty cool, right? Like, I can literally go to my friends around and say, I'm an internationally published author. And the people will pay a lot of money for that. If you're a dentist or, an, um, you know, a dentist will pay a lot of money for that because it looks great on his business card. Same with a doctor, you know, or, an, you know, an architect will pay for that because, you know, they're an internationally published author on architecture. That looks so good on their resumes. They don't care whether they actually make any sales from it. They use it purely as branding and positioning. So it's so easy. And you, again, like I said, you easily get someone to pay you a thousand bucks to do that. Uh, and Tom, just to notify everyone, we, we have one more course with all of our bonuses that's available. So if you're sitting on the fence and, and you haven't gotten in, we have one more. And I'm sure there's probably four or five people that are racing to get this one course right now. So uh, unfortunately, uh, only one person available left so go in get your order in right now that site is www.kindocash.net forward slash gl right and we're going to continue answering questions as well so uh, stick with us but if you are definitely in on this just go in place your order right now and be that last person that gets sent okay. go yeah. ahead Tom. yeah get in there guys because it's uh, it is the life changing life changing stuff and uh, so we got the um, how to turn your books into physical books. Now, again, even if you don't really have any intention of selling a physical book or becoming, you know, the, writing the next Fifty Shades of Grey, that's fine. The thing is, is that when you people search in, we've tested this and we found that once when people search for your books in Amazon, if they're on Kindle, even when they're buying on Kindle, when they see that there is a physical book available, it lends credibility because they just assume that it must be in. Barnes and Noble, it could be a New York Times bestseller. You know, it's a physical option as well. So it will dramatic, it will increase sales by having a physical book. Now we show you exactly how to do this without ever creating the physical book unless someone actually orders it. It's all pre-done, and we're going to show you exactly how to do all this in this bonus right here. Plus the ebook list builder method. Now, you know, you've probably heard the money's in the list. I mean, you're here on this webinar with us because you probably have got an email about it, is I would imagine. Um, so you've got to come and learn some stuff. Well, you can do the same thing. I mean, you can give value to people um, and make recommendations for stuff that, so for example, if you had a, a book on um, juicing, I've got a book on juicing, like um, vegetable juicing. So one of the things that I do with my list from that is recommend like juice products and recipes and things like that and uh, actual um, the actual juices. Well, some of those juices range up to about $1,000 on Amazon. So you can recommend those and uh, do deals and stuff on those as well. So uh, that's just one way. Same with weight loss. If you're doing anything weight loss, you could offer advanced coaching on things like that. I mean, there's just possibilities are endless when you have a list. So we're going to show you how to do that as well. Plus, of course, if you, all of this can be done for you by your, for the, those of you that got the virtual assistant, all of those will be done. All of this extra stuff can be done for you. And of course, you get the course as well, which is the, the full home study course for you and the family to go through. So again, like I said, this is www, go to www.kindlecash.net forward slash GL and uh, place your order. You know, it's you get that 100% money back guarantee as well. So um, yeah, is this for you. So how's the, uh, how are the questions looking, buddy? Are you frantically uh, answering away there? Um, yeah, they're, they're coming in a mile a minute, so we've got everyone that's that's excited, and, and the, the excitement is going insane here in the, in the background. So let's answer some questions. He says, Angela says, I know that you mentioned that you can be up and running in four days. However, with all of the course materials, it seems like it will take longer. Uh, actually, Angela, it doesn't take any longer than that. You can actually go over the course in a weekend. Okay, so this is something that can, and it's structured. It's all systematically laid out to a point where you can go over this. 
in a weekend and you can start uploading your books in a weekend and start to get some results. Now the beautiful thing about this is once you start to see your ebook sales come in, mark my words on this, you will not be able to sleep. There's there's just a, a very exciting, you know, just just very energetic feel about just seeing where people were buying your ebooks. Like for example, when I first started publishing my ebooks on Amazon, you know, I would literally go in and log into my account like every two hours. I would wake up in the middle of the night to check my sales and I'm like, yes, I made another sale. Yes, I made another sale. So uh, just be warned there that, that that's that. And we have uh, Mark says I am in. Uh, Susan says I am in. Actually, we have a little bit of a problem here because we don't have, uh, let's see, the bonuses we have actually sold out. So maybe Tom, maybe we could do something else. Maybe we can get, maybe we can allow a few more bonuses to be to be given. Okay. Well, uh, the uh, that would actually be awesome if you want to do that because I'm noticing here a couple of people as I'm scrolling up the questions box, a couple of people saying that they again they were trying to place their order, but they've been getting where we've got a lot of people going over to the site. They just haven't been able to uh, necessarily access the site. Um, but you, we're not going to go anywhere, guys. You definitely will be able to get there and get in. Um, but I think you know it's not fair to them if they can't get the bonus. So I'm going to twist your arm here, buddy. I think we should definitely. If it's up, if it's all right with you, let's extend some extra bonuses. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's. Uh, I'm just trying to come up with a number. How many more bonuses do you think we I should give away, folks? Let me. I'll let you answer on the questions box. So use the questions box. What do you think would be fair? How many more bonuses should we should we give away? Let's see. What are they saying there? Let's see. Meg says, "Oh, I can't actually do all." Meg, that would uh, cost because there's, it's kind of expensive actually. These bonuses are actually real bonuses, so they cost. So we'll give the next. How about we give the next uh, seven people who order? We'll give them all of the bonuses as well. So you'll get the entire Kindle Cash Flow course, but you'll also get all of the bonuses. All right, so that'll be a total of 17 bonus packages there. We gave away that first 10, and we actually flew through those. Those went really quickly. So if you're on a fence, you now have a chance to be one of the next seven to get the bonuses as well. Whether you're watching this live right now or you're watching a replay, you you have a chance to go. You'll know that we're out of the bonuses when you go to the order page and it's no longer there. So we'll take down the order page once we're out of the bonuses, right? So uh, go ahead. And Jimmy says, I'm in. Save a bonus for me. <laughs> I like your attitude, Jim. Uh, all right. Uh, so that's awesome. Now we've got Rhonda's coming in. Rhonda says, me too as well. Good, Rhonda. Good to have you in as well. All right. Uh, so let's answer some of the questions. Uh, Joe says, can I get a copy of this webinar? You know, Joe, we're trying to make sure that we have a recorded uh, version available, and if we do, it'll probably go out. You'll get a link for it tomorrow. All right, was the information good? I hope it was good for you. Um, let's see. Meg says, can we pick and choose if we don't want the whole package? Actually, Meg, no, it's, a, it's an entire package. Uh, let's see. Do we... Oh, Tom says, do I have to get an Amazon.com account when I have an Amazon.ca account, Tom's in Canada. No, Tom, if you already have an, an Amazon account, you can use your existing account, right? Nick says, I'm in, I just bought it. Uh, Rose says, I'm in as well. Let's see, Jane is in. Wow, they're flying in even faster the second time than the first time, all right? Uh, Benice says, I'm from South Africa, can I do this? Yes, you can, Benice, absolutely. Um, Joyce, Joyce asked, "Are we connected to Amazon in any way?" Uh, no, Joyce, I'm not. I wish I was. A, I wish I was a shareholder in Amazon, but I'm not. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Right. Uh, let's see. Um, how do we protect our own writing? Says Meg. Well, Meg, here the beautiful thing about this is the moment that you publish your eBooks, you make them available to the public. It's copyright. So the moment you publish it to Amazon, it becomes copyright. All right. Uh, Tom says. I already sent you a friend request on Facebook. Why, well, thank you. I don't know if that was meant for me or for Tom. But in any event, thank you. Uh, Tom says, will I get the bonuses as well? Yes, you are in for the bonuses, Tom. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's Let a good question. Uh, good question here. So Nick said, he came in a little bit late. Where is the uh, keyword research tool? So the keyword research tool, just go to Google and type in Google Keyword Planner. 
and you'll find it. It'll be the first one that comes up. So just go, uh, I'll just show you on the slide here what that looks like. Just go into the Google Keyword Planner right here. Hold on. There you go. So if you just go there and just Google, type in Keyword Planner, you'll see it's right there and just go through the steps. And that is the tool. So you can go in and uh, start doing your research right now. Yeah, and Linda says she's placed her order. Uh, does she get the bonuses? Yes, you absolutely do, Linda. Cool. And I've got a quick, uh, just a quick email testimonial here that came in from Vinny to show you guys. Uh, Vinny said, I made $10 in November. Uh, yeah, it's 10 bucks. But in December, I made $950 in sales. That does not include the KDB Select bonus, which we'll cover. We didn't have time to go into on the webinar, but we cover the KDB Select stuff in the course as well. Um, that is across six books. So you made 900 bucks from 50 bucks from six books. Three of those were actually published in December, and that's when he made the money. Um, but he said, he, I think I will hit around $3,000 to $4,000 in January. So again, you see how quickly, guys, this can build up, and um, it just can expose. So he's going to go from uh, from uh, 900 bucks. he reckons the next one is going to go 3000 then to 4000 in January. I keep adding new titles. Like you, I have big plans for Kindle Marketing. And I want to get into well into the five and six figure per month level. So again, see guys, it's not you know it's not just me and Ty. You got the people in the group. Uh, there's plenty of other people that are doing this. You guys can do this, 100%. Um, I'm sorry, I don't know why these videos aren't playing, but actually they are over on the site. So if you would like to go and watch these video testimonials. Um, please go over to www.kindlecash.net forward slash GL. And it's, it's very encouraging to see the video, so I do highly recommend that you take a look at them. Um, it's, it's good to see that you have real-life folks that are doing this, and, and actually that are uh, from all, all parts of the planet, I mean, and that they're doing this and they're getting good results. So please go and visit the site, take a look at the testimonials, and... Uh, if you haven't placed your order yet already, we do have a, a few more, not many more bonuses left. So uh, courses with the bonuses, go in, get your order in. And I think you'll be really pleased with this. Remember, it does come with a full 30-day money-back guarantee, no questions asked guarantee. So you have nothing to lose. All right, so go in and get your order in. And uh, we got another uh, quick um, testimonial here from uh, Chris Brown, who said uh, he was um, sold, his, did his 400th sale for the month in December as well. Um, the income alone from this month will cover half of my mortgage payment. Now I think Chris lives in California, right? So it's a pretty yeah, high, so his high mortgage, mortgage is payment. <laughs> Hi, mortgage payment. But he goes on here to say, needed to say, my family and I are ecstatic. I really want to thank you for your help and encouragement for teaching such an amazing, life-changing opportunity. God bless you, man. So, you know, guys, you can be one of these. So you can be the next success story. You just got to give it a try. You know, you just got to dive in, try it, take action. Let us help you get there and make a make a decision off that. But uh, I know you can. We've had, um, like I said, we got. Testimonials here from Darren De Darren Devery, which Ty mentioned earlier. What did you say, Ty? Darren's up to how much is Darren? Twenty two grand a month now. He's making twenty two thousand dollars a month. His sixty seven year old father is making three thousand dollars a month. And he's just he's just rocking and rolling. <laughs> right. Meg says you guys are are great. Thank you, Meg. I think you're pretty awesome as well. Okay. Um, let's see what else do we have here. Oh, Tom, what I'm going to do is I get the videos on my side, so I'm going to play them on my end here. Let's okay, perfect. See here. All right, so let me just grab the screen from you. And... It's very odd. I don't know why the uh, why the uh, what's occurred there. Okay, let me see here. Can you see my screen now? Can everyone see my screen? Yeah, buddy, we got you. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I just want to make sure everyone else can. Can you folks out there see it as well? Guys, give us a yes in the chat box if the screen's changed. Although you might not be able to tell because we're both on. Uh... Yeah, both look, <laughs> we're both. both on. All right. So let's see what we have here. Do 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 do. Hey guys, yeah, I just want to tell you a little bit about um, about Ty's Kindle program. It's it's pretty amazing. Um, I've been messing around with internet stuff for three years, and I think all of us who 
playing around with it, heard all the hype. There's no hype in this. This thing works amazing. Um, my name, again, I don't know if I mentioned it, Steve Schreier. I have, um, let's see, after a week of listening to his tapes, um, I had a book up and running, and now I have five. Uh, I have two of them that are very successful, and uh, one of them is called uh, How to Stand Up and Paddle for Beginners, and the other one is How to Stand Up and Paddle uh, Surf for Beginners. And those have been increasing every month. So give an example, my first month I made $200. Uh, the next month is $300. And uh, the, my goal is to every month keep on adding a book, and, uh, and that way I know my residual income will keep on increasing. Um, that's the cool thing is one of the things that I loved about Ty's program is that it was effortless. Ty cuts through all the bull. Um, he, he cuts your learning curve down because if you uh, check out his tips and tricks, you'll realize that a lot of this stuff you would never have figured out unless he told you up front. I'll give you one example. It's pretty funny. Uh, the other day um, he mentioned that, you know, uh, hey, price of books at a reasonable price and then start increasing them and see what happens. Uh, I, I did that last week, and I increased my books by about 15%, and I sold more books. And uh, these are the kind of tips and tricks that you would never find out on your own, and Ty has experienced this. So all these things, you put it together, you have a, um, an effortless way of making money. You don't have to know, excuse me, any technology. Um, so it's, it's probably the best thing that you can do right now to make money on the Internet, um, in, including the, the growth of... Uh, the Kindle program, it's its an outrageous setup. So take advantage of Ty and his wisdom and uh, buy the program. You'll have way too much fun with it. Take care. Bye-bye. Awesome. So that was Steve there. And, and Steve actually uh, is now up to the point where he's doing about $4,500 a month. So this is the entire package. This is your diamond mine. Visit the website right now, kindlecash.net forward slash GL to get your copy. Uh, once you place your order, it will be shipped out first thing tomorrow morning. If you're in the U.S., it will take about four business days for you to receive it. Right? If you're outside of the U.S., it will take you about seven business days. Let's take a look at, his, this is one of my favorite students. I actually got to meet her out in London when I was speaking at an event uh, earlier this year. And she's doing some incredible things here. Take a look. Hi, my name is Valerie Pope, and I'm coming to you from my home office just right outside of Charlotte, North Carolina. And tonight I just want to spend a couple of minutes with you just letting you know how excited I am that I purchased Ty Cohen's Kindle Publishing course back last, I believe it was last November. Um, I went through the videos, took copious notes, and got started right away. Um, in about three weeks, I had my first book published, and it's done very well. It went to number one in a niche that I didn't expect it to hit number one in, but um, there you go. I just put the principles to work. Uh, you know, Ty's course is a step-by-step -step guide that even a 57-ish, oops, I just said my age, 57-year-old uh, mom uh, can follow and actually make it happen. Uh, I am thrilled with what I've been able to accomplish and where I'm headed next. I want to show you a couple of my books. Here we go. You can see right here, this is my first book. It's called Westy Bible. And uh, that, was, that was the very first effort that I did following Ty's principles. I quickly also published HCG Weight Loss, The Plan, and its companion book, HCG Weight Loss Recipes. Um, most recently, I've published a book about homeschool transcripts, uh, how to create a high school transcript for your homeschool students. Now, those aren't the only books that I have up, but uh, I think I have two more up. But this is how I'm doing. Uh, you'll see the date on this. I hope you can see it. It says 5-26-2012. Um, and then if I scroll over just a little bit, I hope that you can see that my six-week total for this um, past six weeks is $664.97. I am thrilled that um, my husband and I purchased this course 
and I just can't recommend it more highly. If you're interested in Kindle publishing, learning the nuts and bolts from the ground up, or even if you're some kind of seasoned, I think that you'll probably even appreciate this course if you're a seasoned publisher because there's just so much good information in it. Um, I'll tell you again, if I can do it, you can do it too. Thanks. All right, there we go. And, you know, she's actually doing pretty well with this thing. She's rocking and rolling right now. You know, so when she first started, as you saw, she was just doing uh, just about six fifty, seven hundred dollars $700 a month. And, you know, that just pays for the course. And everything else that you make month after month after month is just additional income. It's just a passive income stream where you're generating money month after month after month, right? So this is your diamond mine. Don't let someone else get to it before you do. Visit the website right now. Here's another testimonial from uh, Darren DeVry. He says, this has Ty been... One, Ty, one right. second. Let me, uh, we just have a quick question that came in, and Daniel asked it a couple of times, so I just want to make sure we uh, answer it here really quickly. Um, he said, because uh, there are with a lot of books out right now, um, with people adding popular topics, is there an issue with copyright? I imagine a lot of the books have similar titles and such. Do uh, you want to just quickly answer that for him? Yeah, absolutely. You know, Daniel, Amazon does a great job at protecting your investment, okay, because this is a business, and this is a business that you want to build on the rock, not on the sand. So by that, I mean when you start this out, you want to start out the right way. So with that said, Amazon does give you a lot of protection. They don't allow duplicate books. They don't allow duplicate content, and they don't allow duplicate titles as well. If you go in and you search the Amazon store, you'll be hard-pressed to find a duplicate title. So... And as a matter of fact, when you're titling your ebooks, one of the things that we talk about, and we show you in detail, I'll just give you a brief description here of how it's done. But in the course, everything that we covered on this webinar, we, we show you in detail, step by step, how to do it. Right? We also show you how to go in and check Amazon and check other sites to make sure that a title that you're considering using is not already in use so that you save yourself the time. Okay. Now, uh, that's a great question. So Keep the questions coming. We're going to stay here answering questions as long as you have them. So uh, there's no such thing as a dumb question. Go in and answer your questions. Here's a testimony that came in from another one of our students. And it says, this has been my best month so far with 258 sales to date with only three titles. Now think about this. Imagine if he's making seven bucks off of each title, right? Okay, that gives him a, just a good amount of money that he's making right there. I'm very happy with the progress considering my circumstances. He went to a bankruptcy, you know, uh, as a result of the recession. And I just wanted to say thank you again. I can see the end of a tunnel. I sent him an email asking him if I had his permission to use this as a testimonial. And then the next day he sent me a reply back and he says, yes, you can use my testimonial. And he says, I'm actually up to 336 sales as we speak. I'm happy with that. I was hoping for 200 sales this month, so I'm really happy. I'm going to try for 1,000 sales a month starting next month. Now, imagine 1,000 sales at $7 profit each. That's $7,000 a month, okay? And this is when he first started. Now he's up to 22000 And as I said, his, his, grand, his father, who's 67, is now up to $3,000 a month. And here's another uh, testimony. This is from Jason Roberts. He says, people need the system. I've purchased many Internet marketing products in the past. But yours is the only one that actually worked just as you said it would. Thank you for being refreshingly honest and providing an extremely easy and safe way to make money online. So there you go. So Tom, what else do we have? Do we have any other uh, testimonials that are coming in? Or actually questions. Daniel, yeah, absolutely. Daniel said, thank you so much for answering the question. No problem, Daniel. You're more than welcome. And uh, Angela... Um, said, I'd like to start outsourcing to save time before the package comes. Can I get some help on that? And I've just put back, yes, hit me up. And Angela, just come and find us in the Facebook group. Happy to help you with that. Love to. I love the outsourcing side of things. So, yeah, absolutely. I'll help you with that. And um, she said, when I entered the, uh, went to kdp.amazon.com, uh, am my Amazon account appeared. Uh, does that mean I have an account with Kindle already, or do I need another account specifically for Kindle on Amazon? No, you can use the same account that you have with Amazon. So the same account that you've, uh, and again, Amazon, they try to make this entire process as easy as possible for everyone, all right, because they need your content, and they want to make it easy for you. So they're not going to overcomplicate the process 
um, because they don't want to, you know, prevent themselves from making money or with the content that you're going to be uploading. So you can use the same account that you purchased from to sell your ebooks as well, right? So that's a great question. And let's take a look at again. If you want to get in on the bonuses, we're going to be closing out this webinar in about another three minutes. If you want to get your bonuses, all of the bonuses that we spoke about, go in and place them now, okay? Before we close out, because once we close this webinar, it'll be too late, uh, and we'll possibly be all out of bonuses, right? So uh, if you haven't written down Take a look at this. Here's a Wall Street Journal article, right? And it's titled Turning Amazon Cash to Kindling. This is a very, very real business. This, I mean, you have credible uh, news outlets, media outlets like the Wall Street Journal writing about this, right? You have CNN, who is here talking about how the ownership of tablets and e readers has almost doubled in one month, okay? So, do you see how the, the marketplace is just continuously expanding? Right, this is always going to be a great way to make income. Uh, here's a Mashable article that says Amazon sells one million Kindle products each week. Wouldn't you like to have a piece of that pie? Right. Uh, here's uh, an article out of a Register, which is a paper out of the UK, I believe. It says nearly a quarter of all books sold in the U.S. in 2012 were e-books. Right. Uh, here's Men's Health. How to become an ebook millionaire. This is an article that was published in Men's Health. With Amazon now selling twice as many ebooks as paper versions, and Kindle offering 70% royalties to offers like you and I and Tom, instead of a standard 15% for publishers, it's time for you to write your way to riches. And they're talking about how people are just. So it's not just us that's talking about this. You have Men's Health, and you have people like, you know, the Register, and then you have publications like Mashable and. CNN and the Wall Street Journal that also are talking about how credible this is. So go in, visit www.kindlecash.net forward slash GL, get your order in. You'll get all of the bonuses, including the Kindle, uh, the Google Kindle Crunch, the Facebook uh, method, the YouTube method. You'll also get your virtual assistant that you can use for 40 hours for free. And it's all backed up by a 30 day money back guarantee, so you have nothing to lose, okay? Uh, I mean, Amazon is just a strong company. Their stock is just continuously rising. Take a look at this curve here, right? It's continuously rising, and it's actually past this number now. It's closer to 400. And, uh, I mean, look at the lifestyle this, that this allows you to, to, to live. This is um, my daughter, Summer, here, all right? She loves beauty pageants, so we travel all over the place, you know, because she loves doing beauty pageants. Uh, this is one of her first magazine covers here. All right, this is the lifestyle that being able to publish ebooks to Amazon has afforded me and my family here. Okay, um, here we are on vacation in Puerto Rico. Again, this is a vacation that was paid for as a result of publishing ebooks to Amazon's Kindle platform. Here I am being asked to uh, host a radio show, and I was able to bring my son on. All right, so life changes when you do this the right way. Right, when you do it the right, right way. Here, my wife and I are. Uh, driving exotic cars, we're driving Ferraris and Lamborghinis and Audi R8s and things like this out in the desert, um, and just having fun. Okay, here we are at Disney World. Okay, uh, here we are taking karate classes and just it, it gives you freedom. Okay, in addition to the income, it gives you freedom to spend with your kids. Here, my daughter is here uh, on a photo shoot in New York, and here she is uh, on the set of Law and Order. In New York as well, so it gives you just options. How many people know this guy right here? Tom, let me know if anyone's in the questions box and they know this guy right here. Who is that? Let's see. Uh, I should, I should hope so with this group. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. All right, let's see, let's see who, who is that guy? And who's, who's this young lady right here? That's to the right. Who is this? This, they get it. Oh man, awesome. Let's see. Ah, everyone knows that this is Tony Robbins, but no one realizes that this is actually his wife, Sage. Okay, and that's me, and that's uh, my wife, Melora. But I mean, this is—I mean, this is one of the things you, you we get to really, you know, go in. How many people would like to go in and hang out and be able to chill out with Tony Robbins and his wife, and just, you know, uh, be special guests backstage and things like that? But this is part of a lifestyle that being able to do this affords you. Okay. Right, so if you haven't gotten your order in yet, go in, 
visit the website okay now so you can go and get your order in I mean this is the real deal here folks here we are in Miami as Tom mentioned we love to take vacations and I mean it, it gives you the opportunity to do so uh, here we are in Costa Rica whitewater rafting just having a, a, a ton of fun here I am in Panama uh, you know here we are in Mexico here we are in the Bahamas um, with some mutual friends of Tom and I here and you know here we are in Vegas here we are in the Caribbean I mean just just having a ton of fun so again that website address is www.kindlecast.net forward slash GL we will be closing out and just keep in mind listen if my 15 year old daughter can do this so can you don't shortchange yourself right do not shortchange yourself I know you understand that the power what the power of the mind is capable of doing it's capable of empowering us on a positive side as well as on a negative end. All right? So don't talk yourself into saying, okay, well, this is too good to be true or that it's too, it sounds too easy or that you're incapable of doing it. Every single person that's watching this can do this right now. All right? Every single person that's watching this can do this. All right? Absolutely. And... Last but not least, every single, uh, lastly, $100 off of every full price sale that comes in today will be donated to charity. All right, so uh, there you go. All right, so you, not only are you uh, helping yourself, but you're also contributing to a worthy cause. Okay, so there you go. Get your order in. And with that said, we will be closing this out. And I wish everyone. A great day, a great morning, a great night, wherever you are in your part of the country. And, you know, congratulate yourself and pat yourself on the back because you did something that most people did not do, and that is you came to an event that empowered you, that educated you, that gave you information and resources that you can use, okay, that you can use to go in and, and, and change your life as well as the life of others. Instead of a Facebook group, if you go and you search for KindleCashflow.com, all right, you'll find it. So Kindle Cash Flow. I'm sorry, I said dot com, but if you go in and you search for Kindle Cash Flow, you'll find a Facebook group. And that Facebook group is only it's private. It's only for members. All right. So there you go. And with that said, Tom, do you have any last parting words? If you haven't written down the URL yet and you're still sitting on the fence, I advise that you go in and write down the URL. It's www.kindocash.net forward slash GL. Okay. Write that down. And Tom, do you have any last closing words before we close off? Yeah, I just want to say thank you. You know, thank you everyone for, you know, who was on here. And it's, it's like Ty said, you know, you are... <clears throat> you 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 showed up to you made a made a difference tonight. You know you made a decision to be on here. You know lots of people would have um, gone and watched TV or just uh, done something else. Whereas you actually took the time to learn something new. So please take action on what we've shown you. And um, you know if you if you if you're on the fence and you think this is for you, join up because like I said, we're here to help you uh, in the Facebook group. You get support. This isn't like you're just gonna be left on your own to your own devices here. And this is the last you hear of us. You know we are here in that group every day helping people just like you succeed with this so um, all that's left is for you to make one more decision and that's the decision to just give it a try you know um, um, that decision once you've made that decision you'll feel great about it and then um, you know we'll be able to help you get going and of course if it's not for you for any reason there's a 30 day money back guarantee so don't miss out please give it a try um, we're here to help you succeed with this and uh, we have lots of people no matter what um, background you have sort of your experience is We've had people succeeding. So, uh, yeah, please don't miss up on the opportunity. Come see us. Come let us help you. Um, and, uh, yeah, thank you for being on here. It's been an absolute pleasure. And thank you so much, everyone, especially Karen and everyone, Daniel, Karen, Angela, everyone. Uh, Everyone who's put the really, really kind words as well in the chat box here. Everyone said how much they enjoyed it and uh, what great value it was. So you guys have been awesome. Thank you so much. It's been a wonder. It's been an absolute pleasure, and we really look forward to it. So with that said, um, we've got to wrap something up, wrap it all up. Um, 
Frida says thank you, Angela as well. Thank you guys, you've been an absolutely wonderful uh, group to have some fun with tonight. And uh, Tom again says thank you as an eye opener. So uh, again, please jump on this, take action now. You'll get the bonuses. Uh, we'll help you get up and running, and uh, you can do this. So uh, I look forward to seeing you in the Facebook group and helping you succeed with this. Um, thanks a lot, and uh, see you all soon. Bye-bye.